Okay. <clears throat> well, we're live. In this stream, I'm going to be playing uh, Real Zoo. It's basically supposed to be like... Hold on. Let me just make sure this is good. It's basically supposed to be like Logan Paul's game. Um, but like some developers made it. And they made it really fast, from what it seems like. Because if anyone's been paying attention, or if you've been paying attention, uh, the CoffeeZilla like, documentary or whatever, like the three-part series that he released about the scams like that came out really recently i think that was like within like the last week so the fact that like someone has already made a game and it came out two days ago is pretty crazy um so yeah shout out to the people that made the game i don't really know who did it I'm, i guess i'll just look at their twitter really quick before i start playing um but yeah pretty much for this duration of this stream i'm gonna be like signing into the game gonna try to like i don't know breed some animals or whatever which i still think is like super weird but whatever um but yeah, I'll, I'll be trying to like make it. And also, I, I did watch their video on it, and like they use stable diffusion, which is cool, um, and like some <clears throat> some like other AI stuff. So let's see. Um, this is so this is it's Yippy. I, I don't think he posts like who it is. He just says game developer. Uh, they also have some merch. <clears throat> My bad. I've been kind of sick lately. So. They also have, we made Mr. Beast's own Among Us map. Okay. I made Among Us map 3D. Huh. So I guess, yeah, they don't have, like, who they are, I guess. Which is cool. And then they have some Instagram, a few followers. Uh, okay. Oh, Coffee Zilla made a post. Felix Bennett said, hey. Hey, what's up, bro? Felix said, I saw how much more popular YouTube channel... I saw a much more popular channel do that. Uh, probably before they did. Oh, wait. So there's another... Are you... Wait. Okay, so Felix Ben, are you saying basically that there's another game out there? Felix Ben said Fireship. Oh, okay. Yeah, I saw... The, yeah, I did see I did see the, the Fireship video about the scam where he, like, explains... Like, Fireship basically, like, goes over and explains all of, like, the different um, technologies that you would need to build a game like that. This is when it said someone made the game before they did, I'm pretty sure. No shot. This one said, ah, okay. Yeah, I, I watched that I watched that fire shit video. I think he just I think he just talks about the stack. This is when it said I've been playing around with with around with uh, GPT Chrome extension. Space a bit more and found some absolutely crazy stuff. Bet. Are, are we talking about the chat GPT for Google where like it shows it on the side? That extension is crazy. Yeah, I think I think you might be talking about this game. Reverse engineering Logan Paul's game. He basically like just shows like the code and stuff that they would have used. It's pretty interesting stuff. Like I did not know a lot about like the NFT stack, but Okay, anyways, I'm gonna go to the I'm gonna go to the game website. And I wanna see let's see. They're calling it Real Zoo, I think. Wait, where'd the link go? Uh Discord Play Real Zoo. Okay, Real Zoo. It's yippy.com. Interesting that this is not a link. Everything else that they put in this video or in this description is a link, but okay, Real Zoo. It's yippy.com. Felix Knight said just Google's locally, then parses the data for a chat to process. Are you talking about Perplexity AI? Or is there another extension? I think Perplexity AI basically like does the same thing. I don't know if they use. I th I think they use Perplexity as a GPT three. Does perplexity AI use GPT three? Yeah, yeah. They also do. Um, they also do use GPT three. It seems like, bro, like half of like the uh, AI startups. I mean, in literally including my product, also just uses GPT three. Okay, so you can log in with Google. I'm gonna do that really quick. Felix, when I said. Web chat, uh, web chat GPT for Google. Okay, I'll have to install it after this. Check it out. Felix Bennett said it integrates directly into Chat GPT. Oh, okay. So, so actually, on like uh, the OpenAI website, it, it basically like integrates in. That's cool. That's actually good, bro. I feel like like Google just has like so much more competition than they did before. Like it's actually crazy. All right, I'm signing into the game. Let's see, sign with the with the burner email. And loads of options. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna look it up really quick on the Chrome store. 
it's called web chat GPT for Google web chat GPT or extension I need to hurry up and fix my extension I got a lot of feedback from it from uh, the people at prime like prime digital Academy and yeah I don't know I have a lot of stuff I can do I think I'm gonna start working on it today too wait this is just chat GPT for Google web chat GPT extension is it this one okay yeah web chat GPT only 10,000 users way less I'm gonna add it to Chrome okay if I have any questions like while I'm streaming I'll probably I'll probably use web chat and see how it works there's so many extensions so fast like development happens so quickly now look at that share full chat threads with random read only web page copy paste superpower chat AI interface Prometheus GPT chat share GPT chat crazy I mean so many extensions feelings bad I guarantee they do that yeah they do I think you're, I think you're talking about perplexity AI using GPT-3 it seems like everyone just uses the GPT-3 model and that there's not really like new models being made it's kind of all like the same AI interpretation of everything Big said they'll 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 be on top and we'll have to figure we'll have some cool like instance like GPT thing. I'm not sure what you mean by that. Then I said look at my look at look at my previous I'm not talking about perplexity. Oh, okay, yeah, no, I think you meant yeah, web chat GPT for Google. I think you meant this. Oh, so you're saying that I guarantee that they do that? Huh. Okay, let's see. So if you sign into the game, they give you, and maybe I should watch this video quick. I don't know. I'll react to the video quick. I'll skip the part where they explain the scam, though. Read from Google 100%. Wait, what? Read from Google 100%. I said, look at my previous, I'm not talking about AI. I'm not, okay, yeah. I figured you're talking about web chat. Oh, shoot. Wait, what is this? Ad blocker for YouTube? What the heck? So yeah, they kind of explained the game. Now we know what to make, but I had a fraction of the resources Logan had to put into the same fish as Dude, I'm not talking about web chat. Oh, my bad. I didn't know. <laughs> so he kind of explains it. The, thing, the only thing I'm really curious about this is like, if you go and you make it this entire game, and you literally say like Logan Paul's game, is that like could Logan Paul like claim the the profit from this since you're you're using his name to, uh to make the game? I don't know. Oh, dude, there's so many. Look, Ludwig commented on this. He said, "I spent three hundred forty dollars on this on to get my stupid mythical animal. Eight out of ten would play again. <laughs> nice." Uh, and also Coffeezilla commented too. He said, now if you just had a criminal record, you'd be qualified to work for Logan Paul. God damn. Things <laughs> said, I'll copy and paste it here to make it easier for you. Okay, bet. Yeah, that helps. All right, so once you log in, you get one egg. So I got a zebra. Okay. Wait, so are these the tokens then? You have to, you have to wonder, like, did this guy do this all just to, like, make money? Like, it's kind of a quick book. This man said, I guarantee they do that. There isn't another way for them. Okay, that makes sense. So, wait, do you just spam? So, I got an uncommon. Okay. Another orca. And these are all made with stable diffusion. Dude, read the whole, dude, read the whole thing. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to go back and read the, all the comments. I'm so confused. Hey, I saw a much more popular YouTube channel do that. They probably did it before Fire Ship. So we established it's not Fire Ship. They made the game before they did. Uh, okay, I've been going around ChatGPT for Chrome extension. Web chat is weird. I understand how they cook, how they coded it. Just Google's locally, then process the data to the GPT process. That makes sense. It kind of works like startup or like, yeah, start page, I mean. Web chat for Google. Integrates directly into ChatGPT. 
look at my previous. I'm not talking about print. Huh, okay. Still very confused, I'm not gonna lie. Let's see how this works. Oh, I'm not logged in. Let's see. Logging with the burner. I need to get um I need to get the temp email service to work. I have like a verify your phone number. Are they joking? What the heck? Read from my comments saying Google 100%. Okay. Read from Google 100%. Oh, you're, are you saying that they're, that the AI is getting the information from Google? Let me see. I don't like that OpenAI wants like phone numbers and all this like other personal information stuff. <laughs> Wait, oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> it's not that complicated. Uh, I'm just dumb, bro. I don't know. Look, read from Google 100%. That's the only thing. Separate to Chrome, right? It was said separate to my GPT stuff. Separate to Chrome. I'll break it down to I'll break it down to small baby sentences for you. I appreciate that. That'll help me understand it. Okay, so this must be the extension down here where it has like search on the web. Oh, you can't see it. It has like some like search on the web stuff down here. Okay. I think they'll come up with something better than OpenAI or buy OpenAI. Oh, this is in reference to Google buying OpenAI. Okay, I understand. That makes sense. I don't think Google's going to buy OpenAI, though. I think it's more likely that um, that Microsoft buys OpenAI because they, provi they provide the hosting. Uh, <laughs> Felix Best said, yes, finally. Oh, my God. Ah. Oh, yeah, bro. <laughs> I kind of just woke up, not going to lie. Oh. Um, but I think it, I think it's more likely that um, Microsoft would buy OpenAI, and that's because Microsoft already provides the hosting for for OpenAI. It's like that huge terabyte of data or whatever. Google will beat OpenAI somehow. Too much st at stake for them. That's possible. Yeah, it's definitely possible. I w I wouldn't. I don't think I would bet on Google doing that. I would bet on them losing. But I don't know. It's possible. They have more like access to good web infrastructure. But like I was saying about Microsoft, though. Um, they're already working at integrating uh, GPT-3 or GPT-3.5 directly into Bing. There's a lot of articles about this. Bing, GPT-3. But I think I think Google already has some like AI wing. If it's, I think it might be, I forget what it's called. Uh, Fieldsman said they will beat OpenAI. Microsoft probably don't have a chance. Felix Ben said, frankly, Google has a larger user base. That's true. They do have, like, a, a big monopoly on search. Felix Ben said no one wants to, to use Bing. That's also true. Um, it's also, like, the third possibility, too, is that um, OpenAI somehow stays independent. And people just train their own models and the, a new model comes out. Felix Ben said, who the hell with more than three <laughs> brain cells will use Bing? I mean, they have a, yeah, I don't know. I I don't personally know anyone that uses Bing. I use, I use, um, when I'm not using Chrome, because Chrome is actually disgusting and basically spyware. When I'm not using Chrome, I use, um, uh, Brave Browser with Start Page. I think that's the way to go. It gives you Google results, but it's end-to-end -end encrypted, which is nice. Google can buy OpenAI if they want to. Yeah, that's true. It's only, they're saying, I read on Reddit today, it's only like 40 billion. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, though, the third, the third possibility is, Someone creates another AI. They train a, a more powerful model that's not open AI. Like that could also happen too. Like there's people like that. There's companies like Midjourney and uh, just more and more other companies that are smaller and more and more. Uh, I don't know if agile is the word, but they could they could potentially make a better model um, and just like 
I don't know, make it more available to people and have people build with that instead. The other thing I said, they will either do that or make their own smarter people that have access to it. Yeah. Yeah, they do. They do have it where like only some people get access to it. It's kind of weird. Also, I need to make it so like the chat shows up on screen while I'm talking because otherwise it just seems like I'm talking to no one if you're rewatching this on YouTube. So my bad. I will try to figure out how to fix that soon. I need to like maybe if there's like a latency. Um, I'm not sure if it's like the stream latency if I'm supposed to go fix that in YouTube Studio. But anyways, back to the back to the game. Um, so once you get here's my first uncommon. So daily yield. What the heck is the yield? Is the yield in reference to these coins up here? Amount of coins. So that would be a dollar. This man said chat replay is a thing. I don't think it's too much of a priority. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah, if it's not, if it's not like too deep then. Oh, I shoot. I forgot to update the thumbnail on YouTube. Let me do that really quick. I did make a thumbnail for this. You'll feel like, check out the, check out the thumbnail I made. <laughs> Let's see. I just got to update it quick. I was going to say though, um, yeah, I, I, is the, so is the daily yield a crude yield one? I would just wonder if the if the daily yield is in reference to Oh, I just noticed this this egg price went up. That's interesting. I wonder if the daily yield is in reference to these zoo tokens up here. But I don't know. I think so. Let's see. Okay, one second, I just gotta update the thumbnail. And okay. Updated it and hit save. Okay. New thumbnails up is pretty good. All right, I'm going to... So, wait, what is it? Oh, when, okay, so it goes yellow. I understand now. It goes yellow when it's... um When you can... When it has a yield. So, the daily yield in total yields 320. Okay, I'm going to try to to burn one of these. I'm going to burn the zebra. I think it's the lamest one. I think Logan was talking about like he wanted to... Feels best to LOL. <laughs> yeah. I think... I think uh, Logan was talking about he wanted to make it somehow so the animals could fight, but right now they really don't do anything besides just a crew yield. Also, how many, how often is 320 divided by, I guess, 24 hours to see how much it does per day? So about 13 an hour? Okay, so like once every four, four minutes? Something like that? Uh, okay. So it looks like also the uncommon yield faster. Okay, I'm going to try to burn the zebra and then see what it would. So would it just give me the full daily yield? Wait. Make changes to the game. It'll have more fun. Burning has been removed. You can now collect coins by clicking on the card. Wait. So I can't. I can't burn it. I'm making changes to the game to make it more fun. Burning has been removed. Okay. All right. I guess so. I'll just keep, so I guess the only thing I can do then is just keep making more animals, I guess. All right. Well, I'm going to try to breed now. Also, it's not responding anymore. Okay, there we go. Oh, wait. So you have to click. Wait, what? Okay, it's just not that reactive. Also, I wonder what he made this with. Let's see if we can check the stack. I was figuring it was going to be react and wait. I think it's react. So you got your div. Uh, let's see. I think he might have mentioned in the video that I was React, but I don't know what this iframe thing is. What would that be? This man said, "Look at the, looking at the line below, burning has been removed, dude." Yeah. This man said, "You have a, re a habit of reading like thirty percent of something, then guessing." Oh yeah, <laughs> yes. <laughs> That is, uh, yeah, that's exactly how I operate. <clears throat> it makes coding, it makes coding hard. Like, I'll read 10% of a Stack Overflow article, then try to fix something, it breaks, and then I have to go read, like, the other 90% of it to get it to go. But, okay, let's see. How do I figure out what the stack is that he used for this? I'm pretty interested. I don't think I can just look at the elements. I, if it was React, then I think it would have, like, that root div thing that, like, React pages have. But maybe not... It's so frustrating when trying to engage with you, LMAO. 
I could, yeah, I could see that. I could see that being frustrating. My bad. I don't know if there's anything I can do about it though. It's just like, bro. I feel like I, I think really like fast, but incomplete. If that makes sense. Okay. I'm gonna give up on trying to figure out this deck, but I am gonna try to breed these. What happens if I just breed? Okay, let's grab the orca. Hit breed. Okay, so it brings you to like this one, this new page. Interesting, he doesn't use any URL, so maybe it's server side rendering. I don't. I, that's a bad guess, probably. I'm gonna try to breed it with a zebra. Do you drag it? Okay, so you also okay, so you have to also click breed, and then it also loads it, and then you hit breed. This man said you can click some card to get money. It says it on the burning. Uh, the burning thing has been removed. Okay, yeah. I think when he says um, that the burning has been removed, I think it's in reference to, or I, when he says like the the you can click on it, I think he means like um, that you can only accrue then. Like the accrued yield is like the only thing that you get, or the the daily yield. Also, the Zorka has a huge daily yield. That's good. That is really good. Okay. Wait. It also got rid of my other two cards. Oh, okay. I don't know how that would happen. I'm gonna try to breed the. I'm gonna try to breed two giraffes together. Let's see what happens if I do that. If I hit breed, and then I hit. Oh, you can't. You can't breed it. Okay, so he hard coded it so that you can't. It has to be like a a new type of animal. Oh, and you also can't breed the zorka and the giraffe. Okay, interesting. You know what I said? I think the game is quite half baked, like a school project. It's cool though. I, I kind of I don't want to like roast it, bro, because I'm a dev too. But like, I would say like, it's not that it's like half baked, bro. It's more like the game just kind of seems to me like they made it just for money, but I don't know, or they made it like just to capitalize on this moment. But at the same time, like, I kind of makes it's like that's not necessarily bad, if that makes sense. Can you all right? Let's let's try the fox. Let's try to breed the fox. But it does, it, yeah, it does seem like in the video I could probably go back and play it. But in the video, like the developer basically talks about like I, he basically says like I didn't make this for money. I made this for fun. But buy the tokens to support the hosting. Um, I thought that was kind of interesting. Like if you if you were to make this purely for fun, I think a better way to do it would be to like basically make um. Uh, what's it called? Like one of those like uh, like crowdfunding websites. Maybe make a Patreon or something, and then have people just donate to the Patreon, and then only use the money for hosting. Fish man, dude, I'd be more chill with monetization if they did well. If they did it while well, like it's not that great in terms of quality. Yeah, uh, yeah, I would say the quality the quality is not like insanely high. Dude, the tokens are gonna bring in a lot of money. Dude, the tokens are going to bring in a lot of money more than hosting. Uh, that's probably true. Yeah, that's probably true. I think so. I, I think know. I'm incredibly generous. I think it might be fun to turn this into an actual game you play using the cards that you have. Let me know if that's something you want to see, and if so, what you would want it to look like. Maybe something similar to Pokemon, or maybe more like Clash. Yeah, so he kind of talks about like making it. Um, Patreon is good for this, I agree. Yeah. As more of like a startup project, because then he can at least hire other devs or just, you know, besides hosting, just make the game like higher quality. Um, Fusman said, I'd be more chill with it with the monetization if they did it well. Like it's not that great in terms of quality. Yeah, dude, the tokens are gonna bring in a lot more money. I think, yeah, I mean Ludwig already said he spent 340 on the game, but I, I just wonder like when you make something like this, uh, his video hit 30 300 thousand views. It must have made at least 10k so far. Uh, hosting is probably like thirty dollars. Lol. That's yeah. I don't ten k. Uh, maybe. Let's see. Let's see the prices. Yeah, I mean Ludwig said he spent three hundred forty on it. I but like, and it's lagging. Yeah, my uh, my question is like, how soon until this just gets hit with a DDoS attack? Like when you make something like this and you put it out like that, how soon until until people are just gonna try to like take it down? More than 10k, probably like so many people. I I want to know who would genuinely, who would genuinely click this and then fill out payment information. So it goes to a Stripe account. 
Okay. I've set up Stripe before. It's actually like, it's pretty easy. To, it's pretty like straightforward. I think if you've coded some other stuff to set it up. So then it comes to like the images of the coins. Okay. This is this is basically. Wait, what? If you go back, it doesn't go back to the game. Okay, that's scuffed. What's it called? The real zoo. That's super scuffed. The stripe page does not go back to the game. All right. Anyways, back to trying to breed this fox. Let's grab this yield. Get a new one. We got a bear. And we got a frog. Oh, the frog is rare. Okay. I think I'm going to breed... I'm going to breed the, the the bear and the giraffe. Also got a new yield. I wonder if he just didn't implement the burn mechanic because he, he didn't have time to. I'm making changes to the game. Burning has been removed. You can now collect coins by clicking the card. Okay. I don't know. Let's hit breed. And then we'll grab the bear. Also, I think... Wait, what? She can't breed a bear. Okay. Also, I think that he he mentions... Wait. This man said, I'm probably going to go big in editing business. May start using Stripe to invoice and processing payments. That's cool. You could definitely set up a, like a website for that. I think people I think people would definitely go, uh, would hire you. Like the, the video that uh, you, co uh, you edited for me had pretty good retention. I think it was at like almost like 2 minutes and 30 seconds or 2 minutes and 50 seconds. Out of six minutes. Anyways, I could send you the retention data if you're interested. Felix Bennett said, just an idea. I don't know. Just an idea. I don't know. At some point. All right. Let me know if you want help making the web page or hosting the web page or like um, getting it up. Um, if you build it in React, then I could probably help or just any other. I can get that up. Can you send it to me? Yeah, I'll send it to you. I'll send it to you after the stream. Um, I'll just send you maybe like screenshots, I think would probably be the best. I, or I could see if you can download retention data too. But I was going to say, though, um, if you make it on, like, React or AWS, I can help with the hosting or or setting up, like, Stripe and stuff. Just let me know. All right, let's hit breed. Oh, gr Grare? Dude, these stable diffusion animals are really cringe. But I wonder how uh, I wonder how he got the – I can get that up. Can you send it to me? Yeah, I'll send it to you. But I, I, I wonder how – um. oh, dude, yeah, if you can help me with that, that'd be great. Oh, yeah, I got you. Uh, hosting with AWS is super easy. It's it's really honestly one click deploy. Like if you're familiar with working with GitHub, um, it's pretty straightforward. Can check check messages off stream. Okay, I got you. Also, um, back to this the Guerrero. Uh, this one is a pretty pretty gross looking. Also, oh yeah yeah, I want to say um Logan Paul, he he kind of made it seem like the game would work in the way that once you breed an animal, uh. With another animal, you can continue breeding it. So, like, in some sense, the Guerrero would be able to breed with something that's already been bred, like the Zorka, and create something that has four animal types, right? But the way that this game works is you only can breed it once, and then that's it. So it's kind of like, I don't know. Uh, it's kind of like limiting in that, limiting in that way. But, okay, let's grab... Let's breed the weakest ones. Let's breed the fox and also how is something that's a base animal uncommon? Oh, two pandas, that's bad. Okay. Let's breed the panda and the giraffe and then we'll breed the fox and maybe the frog, something like that. It's interesting. I wonder if like rarity would increase um as you do more. Also the page back to not responding. Okay, so hit breed. So what did I say? I said panda and fox, I think. I think I said that. I forgot. But anyways, hit breed. Let's see. Fonda. Okay. That's a good yield. Six Mega said, looks like we found a girl for you. Thank you, bro. I know you're a bot, but thank you. Fuseman said, looks like basic HTML. The UX of this game is horrible as well. Uh, yeah, I agree. It's not a great user experience. I, it, the website is not very responsive. Like, I wish they would have used, I don't think they used React. I, it could really just be basic HTML and JavaScript. I kind of doubt that because like that would get kind of annoying to code. I feel like they probably use some framework, but I could be wrong though. He really doesn't get in the video that he talks about it. Dude said a bot LMAO. Oh, bro. Let me, let me dream. Six Mega said, it looks like we found a girl for you. Yeah. <laughs> if you said a mod so I can deal with the bot scum, how do I, how do I make you a mod? I'm using Streamlabs. More yield. 
Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna okay. Let's let's breed again. Let's let's try to breed the weakest one. So that would be the giraffe and the panda. The fonda also just looks like a red panda. So click here, hit breed and giraffe and panda. Also interesting that the yield seems to go up. And I wonder if this was intentional. You would expect it actually to go down when you breed. So this is 320. This is 320. When I click breed and I get this, bro, that's horrific. I get one that has 1600 yield. So that means that the game goes faster as you go up. But I wonder if the price of the egg going up has something to do with it. I don't know. You just said a mod. This mod said, I think it's mod, I think it's mod slash Felix Bennett or something. Wait, what? What if I just click this? No. I think it's copy pasted, so it's horrible to read. I'm not sure what you mean. Maybe the, I'm not sure. The issue with setting up Brave as the default browser, I just realized is it opens... Wait, so links will now open from Streamlabs into Brave? Oh, shoot. Okay, I have to deal with that in a second. I can't get into the chat right now. Also, oh, another question about yield. Will I be able to accrue multiple yield at once? Let's let's actually set up an experiment. So I'm going to not click on the Fonda or Geranda next. And that way I can see if the accrued yield will accumulate. Or if I have to be here, like, actively clicking it as, like, the yield shows up. Also, let's get more animals. Oh, not more pandas. Not more orcas. I want to get new animals. Okay, one more. Let's see. All right, fox again. All right. So, what do I already have? So, I already have Geranda. Uncommon. Okay. I guess all I can do is breed the ones that are already base animals. So, hit breed. And we'll grab, I don't like how it shows, how it shows the ones that aren't base animals, despite not being able to do anything with them. That's kind of scuffed. Let's see. Okay, so we can grab the orca. And like I said, I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave uh, this one to see if it'll like stack the yields, if that makes sense. Okay, hit breed. We got a pandorca. Okay. We still gotta breed the f the frog. So let's do the frog. We'll do that plus. Uh, what's the only other base animal I have? Okay, fox. Oh, that's an amphibian with a mammal is crazy. Hit breed. All right, bet, bet, bet. Let's see. Let's go. Oh god, the frogs, <laughs> the frogs. Oh, that's cringe. Oh, it's a rare though. Jeez, look at that yield. That's nuts. Okay, so that's that's pretty good. We're making progress. Oh, I, did I click the Geranda? I don't remember clicking it. Shoot, did I click it? I might I might have clicked it. All right, we'll just get the egg. So we got a snake. Okay, that's at least something new. Can we breed it? No, nah, we can't breed it with anything. All right, now at this point, we're literally just waiting to get more uh, more yield. Okay, okay. I think so. I want to see what are the levels of rarity. Also, can we find the GitHub? All right, there's a Discord. We're gonna we're gonna join the Discord live on air and just ask questions and see what are what are the levels of rarity. We'll just go in and start asking questions. Also, gotta mute the server or mute the site. Yeah, I just want to see like what are the levels of rarity. I think it goes up to mythic. Let's see. Uh, so here are the rules: don't be the worst, use common sense, blah blah blah. Don't drag other people down. Not no NSW. Okay, sounds good. Sweet little welcome message oh wait that was the wrong emote there we go okay um so where can i ask questions okay here's the there's an faq section so let's actually read this first okay so here are the ones we have we have legend common uncommon oh Felix man said it's good for you to be to could breed animals like pandora with frocks yeah i agree like that's kind of what i'm saying like they need to have more breeding available than just like the simple ones like that are there. Like just like just breeding the starter ones. And then he says Pandora with Fox, but probably too long to get all those images for the developer. Yeah, I think th I think the the best way to do it is if they could somehow integrate stable diffusion directly into the game and that sort of things would be so crazy like if the AI could generate the the images not before the game is developed and then hard code it 
just have the AI directly in the game. Um, so it comes up with the images kind of as you go. That would be ideal. But at the same time, that, that would be really hard to to get like the right images, I guess, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah. All right, so let's see. We got, he has kind of like some explanations of the game. This will be expanded for now, but please read this. Will there be cryptocurrency added to the game? No. That's good, honestly. I, I feel like it's better without crypto. Crypto just kind of makes it sketchy for some reason. Or is there another rug pull like crypto? Yes, this game will continue. No plans. There are plans to add more features. That's good. I like that. I like that he's saying that he's going to plan on expanding the game. Viewsman said, yeah, if it got the images wrong, it would look stupid. Yeah, it would just be cringe. But if you could get it right somehow, that would be ideal. How is this made? Oh, well, thank you. So it was, first of all, it was server-side rendering because they used Felt and they used Firebase and they used TypeScript. So they actually, like, this is a good stack as far as, like, web dev goes. Like, this is a, a pretty ideal stack. Felt is, like, super new. Firebase is really popular. I think so. That would be what they use for hosting or for cloud. Is a detailed document to crop work from SDK to build and ship apps? Oh, never mind. Is it a... Yeah, maybe it's not what I thought it was. I thought Firebase was hosting, but I, it looks like I'm wrong. I guess it's just an SDK for Svelte, maybe? Huh. I don't know. I'll come back to that. And then I use TypeScript. I assumed on the full stack, because if you're using Svelte, you can use TypeScript on both the on both the front end and the back end. Oh, so, it, okay, they can host with Firebase. It is hosting? Okay. I wonder why they called it an SDK, then. I'm, I'm not sure. Yippee Enjoy sent me a message. No, is it not a message directly? There's a new mention. Oh, there's also a whole bunch of people live. That's interesting. I wonder what is going on there. Respectful lads. So are the dudes playing the game or? Okay. That's interesting. So it looks like maybe he's developing the game here. Let's actually hit watch stream. I want to see what's going on here. So what are they talking about? It is hosting, usually usually used on mobile apps, okay, and micro applications. I would consider, this is probably considered good enough like to be like a, a micro app. So this must be him developing the game, maybe adding more egg types, I guess, because this is not in the game right now. Um, But I'm not hearing anything. Did I mute it? Okay, yeah, I muted it. Let's hear what he has to say. I can't hear anything. It does, say, it does say that they're talking. Huh. I don't know. I'm assuming that this is just game dev. Feels like maybe he'll be able to get some more capable developers on board. That would be good. That would definitely be good for the game. I'm not good for Logan Paul, though. Like, if you're Logan Paul, bro, and someone has literally already made your game. Like, I know they didn't use crypto, but, like, two dudes basically made your entire game. Or at least an MVP of your game. Like so much faster and i think like the issue with crypto zoo and like logan is like he's he hasn't made tech before like he, he says it i watched i was watching like the recap video to research the video that I'm, I'm making for sunday and he just says like in the video like tech is really hard it's like yeah bro if they used crypto if they would have it would have taken ages it would have taken longer but not as long as it took logan it, they could have done it much faster than logan like the thing like the thing is is Logan, like, you, you kind of could get the sense that, he, and he kind of says this himself, he doesn't actually build the products himself. He hires people to do that. And when you're not putting in direct equity or sweat equity into what you're coding, you kind of get, um, like, you get stuck and you're kind of reliant on other people. And he doesn't, he didn't really seem to ever understand the underlying technology or, like, uh, the actual, like, development process. And I think that really, like, slowed him down. There's not a lot of tech founders who aren't also tech people. Like, most of the, the people that do come out, like, OpenAI, et cetera, et cetera, those are people who are from the tech community um, who have, like, at least a decent understanding of, like, the development process. And so, like, for someone to come out outside of tech and to try to, like, build a big tech startup, it kind of makes sense. Like, yeah, bro, you didn't know what you were doing. Like, not that I know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. But, like, it kind of makes sense, like, that the thing was worked out like that. This man said my website would be probably Chakra UI next. I assume you mean Next.js. And I think it would probably be a good stack. Yeah, that could work. 
I don't know. Why would you? Why wouldn't you use um uh, Tailwind? That's just what I'm wondering. Over why why Chakra over Tailwind? Unless it's not compatible with Next.js, I don't know. I have not. I haven't used either of those. I, I'm still in the React world, pretty much. I think, yeah, for pretty much all my projects, except for the Chrome extension, which does not use React. Uh, cause it doesn't need it. I use some random, random SDK, SDK called inbox SDK that I just l had to learn. Let's see. So, all right, back to this Twitter and, and this discord, the increase me enough coins to get in the shop. Everybody, they, oh, wow. Look, you can tell you actually, you know, you actually might be, might be right about the 10 K. He said he literally increased the amount of coins you can buy. That's interesting. How many followers do you have on Twitter? He's already up to almost a thousand followers or halfway there to a thousand. That's good, bro. Also, that lion is sick. The lion snake? That's tough. I want to get that. All right, let's see if we got some more yield. Where did the game go? Oh, they they don't have a they don't have a, a, a is it called a five five icon icon or what's it called the little icon up here? They don't have the icon set up. That's too bad. Also, it looks like yield um, accrued yield does hold. Although I probably should check if it can go above the amount of daily, but that would just take too long. All right, so let's grab these. Let's grab these. And then now, you know, this game this game is honestly like a glorified version of Cookie Clicker. If you really think about it, it's basically Cookie Clicker, but with more steps. Next is better than React. Felt is good too. Yeah, I actually kind of agree. And I, I, I kind of agree. Even though I haven't used Next.js, I, I understand like... The advantage of not having like a front end and a back end and just doing server side rendering is nice because to communicate with your front and back end gets kind of annoying. And with React, the only way you really do that um, are with with just like really bloated libraries. Not super bloated libraries. I mean, they are like good, but I don't know. I get kind of like, yeah, I don't I don't really like having like a server and a and a and a front end having to communicate. And it just makes the deployment process harder. Like with AWS, it's harder to deploy it because you have to deploy each kind of separately. Um, maybe if you made like the, what's called a Kubernetes, I haven't used it yet, but apparently like that can work too. It's like you deploy your front end and your back end in like kind of a box environment on one machine and then you interact with the whole machine that way. That could work too. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know enough about deployment. Hopefully, I'll learn more this summer at my internship. If we use Next to make my site, we'd probably deploy it on Vercel. Okay. Yeah, that could work. I'm down to try to, to learn new uh, new tech. Deploy, preview, ship, front-end teams. Okay. That's a bit. It seems like there's a lot of smaller um, like cloud hosting companies that are Vercel, Vercel own Next, LOL. Oh, okay. That would make sense. It seems like there's like a lot more um it's like smaller uh uh cloud providers that are kind of like getting more popular. Kind of like Fireship and they're kind of eating into the AWS market share. Look at the clients they have. Uh okay. I'm I'm not sure I'm not sure if you mean like client as in like They make like 50 million a month. Bro, why is that not us? That's crazy. But also that makes sense. They 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 do like for self revenue peaked eighty k. No, this is not right. No, that's not right. Vercel is twenty five point five million. That's this must be old. I assume this is the same Vercel. I don't know. SaaS revenue is interesting. Like every nah, look at who works for them. Uh, staff. I'm not sure what you mean. That's 2021. Yeah, it makes sense. And like, from what I've been understanding, they popped off this year. That makes sense. From what I'm understanding about like what's going on with like which you no know, like which clients, I don't. Oh, okay. For sell, uh, clients. Meet our customers. Okay. I think this is what you mean. Oh, shoot. Netflix and Patreon? Wait, what? 
Okay, that's yeah, that's oh, okay. eBay using them is insane. Although a lot of these a lot of these platforms they they'll they'll distribute their cloud computing so they won't have everything on the same company. Um so it's not like it's not like all of Netflix is is built on Vercel. They might have hosted they might have host maybe their app. They might even host something smaller than that. They might use it for an internal tool to test it out and to see if it's better. Like a company's not going to just like as large as Netflix only have one cloud hosting provider. They're going to use it for for different projects within uh different teams. So yeah, McDonald's, Twilio, yeah, they have some huge huge companies using them. Bro, that would be so inspiring to build something like this. Like that would be so sick. I mean, I'm I'm nowhere near building anything like that, but like I would be hyped to do be doing this kind of work. Like that's fire. They host the they host their front end on Vercel and video on AWS and Google Cloud. That makes sense. That makes sense. And Fireship is owned by Google too. I did not know that. I did not know Fireship was owned by Google. Not that small is considering it used by every mobile app. Okay. See, that's that dude. That's like the way like these like tech monopolies work. Is like you think you're using Fireship and like eating up Google market share, but you're you're you know you're literally still using Google. All right, let's let's get some of this. Let's go back to this game. Let's grab some some more of this yield. All right, and then let's. Can I breed? Okay, we can breed the fox and the snake, but I'm gonna wait until I get. I'm gonna wait until I get a uh, what's it called, a lion, because I want to get the, the lion that's in this dude's Twitter bio up here. I think it's pretty fire, the lion snake. Yeah. Oh, and then there's like this weird goat thing. Oh, okay, there's a lion zebra, and then there's like this panda, panda fox, and then Yippy has like the duck as his profile picture. <laughs> that's funny. Bro, yeah, I, I do wonder. You're actually right, bro. It might be more than 10K already that people are spending on this. I'll not be surprised. Felix Bennett said, and Vercel uses AWS, I'm pretty sure. They don't have their own servers. Just optimize deployment and manage hosting for you. Okay. That's interesting. So they're kind of like a, I guess, uh, I'm just trying to think of like what would be like the, uh, like the inter, inter, I don't know. It's kind of like they're, trying to think like they're basically they're basically just managing your cloud for you i guess kind of like you said yeah yeah they're middle manning thank you my, my, my brain didn't want to come up with a word it's extremely good for next as they found as they fund it i think that wait i think that i heard that next now has like some paid features in it i could be wrong bro but i think i heard that next js basically has like some some features like some libraries that you basically have to pay for to use it since it is now behind Verso, but I could be wrong. Probably in the high 50k range is what Yippie made. Uh, I would say 50k is that would be definitely on the high end. But I would not be surprised if he made like 10 or 15k off this. That's a dude. That's cool. Make that much in tech like that fast. I wonder if he can sustain it though. Like you have to you with something like this, bro. You have to make the game better. Like if you want, if you really want, like, so far or like twenty five k, yeah, twenty five k would make sense too. Like, but I was like, I was saying though, with something like this, bro, you have to improve the game to get people to come and spend more. Like, you can make, you know, ten or fifteen k, um, in one in you know one or two weeks. But if people aren't coming back to the site to play the game and to like keep accruing the yield or whatever and to trying to get all like the mythics, then it's not gonna it's not gonna be like sustainable long term. Oh, uh, let's see. All right, so we got some more yield. I'm gonna try to breed it. Yeah, we gotta we gotta keep breeding to get better uh, animals. So, all right, so hit breed, and we have the orca, and then I know I want to save the snake. So let me breed it. I'll breed it with the zebra. Wait, no, I don't want to have another zorka. We already have the zorka. Let's breed it with the fox. I think. Yeah. So hit down here. Dang the you, bro. The UI is so scuffed. All right, hit breed up here, and then breed it. Oh, sick. A fork it. <laughs> Coming up with the names had to have been fun. All right, let's grab this yield. Grab this yield. Are we close to... Okay, we need five more coins to get another one. So we have a, one more common, which is... No, we have one more base, which is zebra. And then I think that's the last base one we have. Yeah. Okay. So I wonder at the... I wonder what the rate... um The rate at which you're able to accrue faster and how much that's changed compared to the egg rate if that's linear and this is exponential it could be a difference feels bad 
nah, it's, it's, it's going to die no matter what, unless he employs much more people to make a big thing, maybe a mobile app with gifting. It's def going to die unless, so, unless something like that happens. Yeah, I, I agree. They do need to, yeah, mobile first is going to help a lot. Um, cause I think this kind of game, I'm not sure how many people are like, you know, hyped to like sit down and like play this, but at the same time, like it could, it could keep getting bigger depending on how big the Logan Paul scandal goes. Cause if people are still talking about this in a week, um, and it's still like, I don't know, like the, the penguin zero video had 4 million views. Like if people are still talking about this and it's still like a, a big deal, then I feel like the game could still make a bit more revenue over the next month. Let's grab this yield. Grab the yield. I need to figure out like where is the ideal place to click, because it gets kind of like annoying the 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 UI. All right, get another egg. We got another snake. Okay, that's good. I'll just breed the snake and the zebra then. I think, because now we have two snakes. Yeah. So go up here. Um, hit breed. Grab a snake. Hit breed. And then hit breed again up right up here felix man said no one enjoys playing it in the it at the minute and the second logan paul dies down boom um yeah also dude this is this this is so terrible to look at this hurts my this literally hurts my eyes the snebra oh god that's <laughs> so gross uh not a fan bro ah the snebra <laughs> Bro, this is nightmare fuel. Stable diffuse and nightmare fuel. I think I think the Guerrero is, is also nightmare fuel too. But some of them are cute, but like these are bad. No one enjoys playing at the minute. I would say I, I don't think I agree with that. I don't think no one enjoys playing. Like they have a what well, seems like a pretty active Discord. So at least there's some people like interested in it. There's a chat, let's see. Stage one zero zero. I didn't know. <laughs> Someone said supercell. This does honestly this does look like a supercell game. Like it's it is pretty close to that kind of vibe. Also, we have to close we need to close this. Okay. Didn't know you needed art like that in my life. I love AI human club. Oh, this is the snake fox. I don't want I dude, I don't want all of like the I don't want all of like the animals like leaked to me. I still want to get like some surprises. Also, I'm gonna I feel like I'm gonna open this message quick. Let's see. How to moderate on YouTube. Okay, bet, bet, bet. I'm going to read this after, and I'll probably do it in the next stream. Let me just open that. Okay. How to moderate live chat. All right, back to... Wait, where'd the... Shoot, where'd the Discord go? Okay, Yippee enjoys. Great Discord name. Yippee can do PvP off strong check each deck is. Oh, so Yippee's literally in... Oh, he's live in the Discord right now. I could paste I could paste the stream in in the Discord, although they might get mad because I just like low-key self promo. Isn't unstable diffusion a thing? Like removed, like removed censorship. I don't know about it getting five million dollars on Kickstarter, but getting removed by Kickstarter. Should you look into it on? You should look into it on stream. Wait, I I'm not sure if you mean like so stable diffusion. That's just the AI technique. So I'm not sure if you mean like. I'm not sure if you mean like the game getting removed. I don't know. I heard about it getting like five million on Kickstarter. I'll look up. I'm gonna try to look up what you mean. Stable diffusion. Five million on Kickstarter. Oh. <laughs> Why would they shut this down, bro? Let the bo bro. Let the. Let the boys get the AI, bro. Why would they shut this down? If this is what you're talking about, bro, that's lame that they shut this down. This needs to be a thing. It's going to be a thing. Let it happen. That's funny. It's a tech, tech crunch article. It's cool. Okay, I'll read it. We need to, bro, this is like, this is like that weird, like, censorship stuff. Like, just... It's, I mean, me personally, I'm not going to watch it, but like, bro, who cares? Like, it's just stable diffusion. It's literally just a drawing. It's not, it's not any different than like a real person doing it. You know, if people are already, if real humans are doing it on the web, like, why not just let drawings of it exist? It doesn't really matter. A group trying to monetize uh, words I can't say. 
Unstable Diffusion has raised they raised fifty six. Bro said five million. <laughs> Listen, bro, I would put in I would put in a few k into this project, bro. With eight hundred sixty seven backers, now as a Kickstarter charges changes its thinking about what kind of AI broad that it will allow. That's boo lame. I don't like that they took it down. I don't like that kind of censorship, bro. Like, uh, said not NSW SOW. It wasn't five million, but still, yeah. I don't, I don't like that they like that Kickstarter would take something like this down, bro. Like, I'm, I'm not like a big like oh freedom of speech or whatever, but like, bro, it's not, it's not that big of a deal. Like, it's 56k. Like, they're it's they're not they can't even set up their own models with 56k. You would need more than 56k according to what I read on Reddit today. You would need more than 56k. Um, I, I want to see if I can pull up, find that Reddit article where they, or Reddit thread where he, this dude was basically explaining the cost of OpenAI. I'm pretty sure I can just find it really quick. Let me find it really quick. But it's basically like talking about like the cost of OpenAI. Hold on. Reddit.com. Bro, Reddit, since I started using it, my favorite website on the internet. Literally so cool. I can't believe I'm so late to this. Okay, let's see. So here are my notifications, five upvotes. Okay. So here's some thread that I was on on Reddit. And basically like this dude was explaining that uh this AI model is worth thirty billion, blah blah blah. I started arguing in the comments like a nerd. Um <laughs> and I think he I think someone basically said that it would only cost like a hundred to two hundred K to train up your own model. And Maybe if I get a little bit more experience, I would, I actually like genuinely would try to do that because if you at least own your own model, then you're not reliant on like the GPT-3 API to make, uh, to, to do the writing for the easy write extension, but that would be down the line. Felix Bennett said, wait, what, why do you need more than 50 K? I could probably make a model on my PC. You would need more than 50 K to make a large language model. Like, like GPT-3, like your PC could not handle the training that would go into um like a large language model like that and i think that's why like open ai ended up using azure um it cost open ai open ai three million a day in request not making the model itself wait what how do you know it costs gpt3 three million a day okay so someone said open ai is not unique competitors are appearing this is what i'm referring to as as far as like the ai like self-hosting ChatGPT, like stable diffusion. So are you saying that basically like the request is what's making it more expensive? So OpenAI is not unique. Competitors are appearing. A usable GPT-3 style system needs to be under one terabyte of GPU and RAM plus 32 GPUs at under 50K. That's affordable for many firms. Wait, this guy is saying that it's affordable? I was surprised someone that was saying it was expensive, but I could be wrong. Maybe I just misread it. So yeah, okay, this is the, what someone else was saying, that it, the hardware cost was like super crazy expensive. I don't want to read this entire thing right now because I need to <laughs> I need to be collecting my yield. Let me collect this yield quick. A collect all button would be nice. Chrome extension? Sam Allman, OpenAI founder, tweeted costing uh, th 3 million a day. God dang. I need to get... Uh, I need to get my Twitter up and running so I can have it like post when I go live. That would be nice. Self-hosting ChatGPT. Yeah, them cost to get, cost to get like, or er, having it cost them three million a day is crazy. That's a lot. I would not be surprised if they did like an advertiser model or something similar to Google, um, since a lot of this information is like free and available. Like if if ChatGPT ended up with have ended up having like ads every like third or fourth request, I mean it, it would ruin the experience. But like I would not be surprised if that ended up being a thing, or that they had ads like on the website. Um, the only thing is that it's they're saying it's a nonprofit, but I don't know. Those men said read. Okay, I'll read this whole thing. See, I told you, bro. I almost never read this stuff, I, at least all the way through. The hardware costs alone are everything involved. It's just a bare minimum barrier to entry. No, a single 80 euro bam we'll say around 15k we're looking at 200k for the gpus and we'll get one terabyte 200k for you yeah. so he's saying all right to summarize he's saying that half a million dollars for the hardware okay just to think i'm trying no my link not this not some little dream on reddit 
<laughs> Love and Video. <laughs> <laughs> oh okay are you talking about uh the how to make you a mod link let's see let me go back to here uh let's see okay not some little dweeb on reddit is funny now you proving yourself wrong while trying to prove yourself <laughs> while trying to defend yourself <laughs> oh you cannot see the link i put in chat oh no i don't see a link Bro, I, I I tried to I tried to read it. I, I genuinely tried, but reading is a challenge. <laughs> that brings us to the last point. The experts actually take the data and the hardware to train on a pretty Ah, this is a good point. The amount of people you can hire to do this stuff. You can't really find someone on Fiverr that does that. DM'd? Okay. Ah, gotcha. I read a fit five hundred page book. On getting rich today, lol. Felix Menon, bro, I kind of believe you. Felix Menon said, I read a 500 page book today. I kind of believe you that you did. I don't know. What book was it? Also, let's see this link. So, not the Kickstarter campaign. Hey, if Easy Ride doesn't work out, bro, Easy Unstable Diffusion Part 2 coming. I'll make it. So, let's see. Where'd the link go? Oh, wait, there it is. Here's the Forbes article. ChatGPT creator OpenAI discussing value in the company at 29 billion. Report says, "Oh, you read Think and Grow Rich? Some book by Napoleon Hill. I assume you. I assume you read Think and Grow Rich. Written in like the 1900s. I, I dude, I tried to read that book and I just found it. Yeah, uh, Fieldsman said, yeah. I dude, I tried to read that book and I just found it like so cringe. Like, the idea that you're gonna mindset your way into like wealth is kind of cringe. Like, you need to." You need to, I don't know, from what I can tell, you either need to be a creator and, like, do, like, really creative stuff, or you need to be at the head of a company, like the CEO, or you need to found a company that does a lot of value, provides a lot of value for people. Um, that seems like kind of like the three ways that, that seems like it works for people, but I don't really think there's an answer. Felix Bennett said, like, overselling it? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's kind of weird, like... I don't, I don't really think like, I don't even think you should even really like try to get, like you should not have like getting rich as like your, your number one goal. Wait, this man said, but like, it's about the mindset rich people have rather than getting rich itself. Yeah, that's true. I wonder, I don't know, like me personally, bro, like my, my mindset will never be try to become rich because like, that's not really like what's important. Like, I feel like there, there's other things that are more important because like if I if I was super rich, but I only had like an hour a day to myself, there's no point in being rich. I would much rather have like no money and a whole bunch of time to like spend reading about I don't know <laughs> random open AI stuff or like other stuff like that. Like that 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 to me is like more valuable like personal time than um the money because like like you only really have a certain amount. It's like everyone only has like 24 hours. So if you spend all your time just like working then you kind of like miss out on a lot i feel like if i'm feels meant that if i'm not rich i can focus on more important things money buys time in my opinion time doesn't buy money that's interesting this man said money is a tool for time time is a tool for time is a tool for money i do agree with that 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 um money is a tool for time because like if you if you do have like a whole bunch of money at that point you can also hire people to do stuff and that saves you a ton of time to like not have to um like do individual tasks yourself so yeah there is that benefit though to having a whole bunch of money base dwl said how do you think how do you think intro to programming is i'm not sure if you how do you think intro to programming is i'm not sure if you mean like at umd or i'm not sure also base dwl i see you liking my tiktok bro appreciate that uh, I'm gonna read this. I'm gonna read. Keep reading this Forbes article. Also, really quick, got to collect the yield. Collect the yield. Collect the yield. Collect the yield. Let's go. Let's go. I want to try to max out this game. I'm gonna ask really quick in the FAQs how many animals there are, or maybe I'm not supposed to ask it. Ask it in the Discord. I don't want to get like banned right away, but I do want to like know how many how many animals there are in this game. Yo, someone got a legendary Rhinug. Rhinug. 
Yaley, daily yield is 10k oh my gosh bro i don't i really don't want to ask it in the general because it's that'll be so cringe i'm gonna okay i'm gonna check faqs first okay let's see are there new animals yes spreadsheet publicly available adaptable oh, okay okay there is a there is a spreadsheet on how many animals there are which is kind of weird. Like, I don't know. I feel like as a game provider, like, maybe would you want to not reveal that right away? But I guess people would, they would find out eventually. Okay. So, can I count how many are in this row? Is there a way? I could sort it. Um, Let's see. So, here are all the comments. Oh, okay. No, no. They're numbered right here. So, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 22. No. That can't be right. There's only six commons no nah. i feel like i'm reading this wrong uh common verified breed right top common brain reading in one comment i think i'm reading this wrong i'm not sure we'll come back to this problem we'll figure this out in a second back to the forbes article opening eye the artificial intelligence company behind viral chat okay so this is talking about like their 30 billion dollar valuation okay yeah kind of what <laughs> i said this dweeb on reddit was talking about it's just funny. <laughs> just calling him a dweeb. If OpenAI reaches 10 to 15 billion in revenue, that's going to justify this sort of price. If they've had 10 to 15 billion in revenue, they would they would be worth um, 100 billion dollars, I think. Like way more, way more than 30 billion. But I don't even know what revenue they have now. Maybe they only have like revenue with like the private deals that they made with companies like Copy.ai or. Um, a uh, company like uh, like GitHub for like uh, GitHub Copilot would be their revenue. Um, still, they don't have revenue from like their API or just from like their chat GPT service. So I don't know. But all right, yeah, that's enough of that that Forbes article. Let's go back to let's go back to breeding these animals. Grab this guy. 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 Okay. So now we can buy. I think two two more eggs. Yeah. Okay. So we got the bear. And let's see, we got a, oh, let's go. I got a lion. That's hype. Okay, so now that I've got the lion, okay, that's sick. We can now breed the lion with the snake, and we get the lion snake. Felix Bennett said, well, they are spending $3 million a day. It's like Facebook. They didn't monetize at first. And I think OpenAI is very monetizable in terms of the data framing for the Chinese gov down the line. Okay, I have no idea what you mean by for the Chinese government. Um... But I do know what you mean by like the Facebook, um, where Facebook did not monetize right away, which I think is a really good idea, honestly, especially if you're just trying to reach like product market fit or whatever, you don't need to try to monetize right away. If you have like a little bit of look, look at into look data farming into the Chinese government. Okay. I will look into that right after I finish, um, breeding the snake and the, and the lion, but wait, what the heck was I saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, like, kind of like Facebook, though, like, I think that is a good idea to, like, not monetize right away because you kind of risk, like, making your product seem, like, cheap um, versus, like, building something, like, that's super quality that people, like, love because you can always monetize it down the line. Okay. Snake and Lion. I don't know what the name for it is, but I'm hyped on it. The Snion, dude. Let's go. The reason I wanted it is because it's in um, Yippie's uh, Twitter bio right here. I think that's sick. I think that's the, I think that's the snion. I think so. Look, it has like the the fangs. Interesting. It's actually it looks like it might be a different picture than the one that's in the game. This game is really cheap. Really, it looks like something a middle schooler made. <laughs> I don't know, bro. I feel like a middle schooler could definitely make this. Like, I I do know some. At least when I was in middle school, like my friend, um, I thought I used to think this was the. Cool, I still think it's really cool, actually. He had an app on the App Store, um, and he made, like, 20 bucks from it. But, I don't know, back then I thought that was, like, literally the coolest thing ever. So, yeah, I guess a middle schooler could make this. If a middle schooler learns something like Svelte, though, like, that's pretty cool. Compared to, um, I don't know, I guess I don't know what framework he would have used, but, yeah. Felix Bennett said it's almost like it's a cash grab. Huh. I mean, yeah. I mean, the thing that the thing about this being a cash grab is, like, so was Logan Paul's game. That was also clearly a cash grab. Like, everything about crypto is a cash grab. It's it's such, like, low value for the people involved in it. Um, I don't know. 
It, it would be better. I don't know. It would be better if people like try to build good products first, but I don't know. Even like easy, right, bro? I'm really trying to make sure that like I build a good product for users and like try to make that the priority versus just like trying to make something that goes viral. <laughs> I just want to pay for the servers. <laughs> Yippee 2022. <laughs> I mean, yeah, bro. I, I don't know. I'll see if he's still in the, let's see in the, if he's still in the discord. Should we do, uh, uh, <laughs> banned from Yippee discord speed run? That could be funny. I don't, I don't know. I don't want to get banned, bro. I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't, uh, I don't hate this dude. He didn't do anything to me. I am going to ask in general at my own risk, uh, how many, no, no, no. I'm actually going to ask, where do I ask questions? Let's just ask, where do I ask questions? Let's see. Also, is that live stream still going? Because no one was talking in it. Okay, yeah, yeah. It looks like it died down now. But there was like a development live stream that was going. But. Oh, interesting program would be to make is to make like the, uh, the camel, uh, not camel case, but like the, you know where you wrote like, I just want to pay for service. Make a program that can uh, convert text into that style. That'd be sick. Felix Bennett said, so say, say how much has Yippie made? It will definitely not. It will definitely not all going towards servers. Will Yippie be made transparent about this? I, here's the thing, bro. He doesn't. He doesn't have to be transparent. No game provider is transparent. No one knows ex unless they're a public company. In which case, yes, they're legally transparent. But like most private companies, bro, they're not really super transparent in about their revenue. Um, so like if he doesn't answer this question, it's not really like a big deal. Felix Bennett said, "Say that in the Discord. Say I won't." Say I won't press pay. <laughs> Go. <laughs> Let me see the band speed run. <laughs> Yippee Discord band speed run. I don't want to do it with my personal with my personal Discord. I need to I need to <laughs> Felix Ben said you won't know boss. That's too late, bro. I already sent it. <laughs> Yippee. Wait, why am I still in voice chat? What the heck? How do I... I need to leave voice chat. There we go. Imagine I was unmuted this whole time. <laughs> Yippee, Yippee Discord ban speeder. <laughs> what if I became a... A, 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 spe a speed run. A ban from Discord speedrunner. Like, if you ever saw, like, the... Um, ban from Pokemon Twitch speedruns. <laughs> Bro... <laughs> Those were lit those were lit okay, ban from ban from Pokemon Twitch speedruns were actually like the funniest thing on on YouTube on like on Twitch for me for like a while. I just thought they were hilarious. Like people would go in and they would literally just say tier three sub and get banned. Let's see, someone responded in general. Yo, it was ten K, bro. Felix Ben said he can't be spending all of it. He can't be spending... Jax is typing? Let's see. He can't be spending all of this newfound fortune on servers? No. Hell no. He's got to be spending it on more than just servers. Or your message makes no sense. Oh, well. I'm not sure what message you mean. Say, it's all on servers. He said it in the video. Okay, hold on. Let's watch the video. Let's watch the end of the video and actually check specifically what he says. Because I don't want to be, like, saying something that he didn't say. And you have extra money. You can play the entire game. Okay, first of all, saying you can play the entire game for free, that's true of almost every game. It's more so just like how much time it takes. I added accounts and stored player progress. I also wanted to learn how to buy, I don't expect it to be much. Wait, what? I mean, if you want to support and you have extra money and added the ability to buy coins, please only buy anything if you want to support and you have extra money. You can buy. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't understand, like, are you supporting the game? Or are you trying to play the game faster? Like, which one is it? Play the entire game for free. It does cost me some to host the site and transfer data, mainly the pictures. But Hosting the pictures, that can get a little expensive. It's, at least as far as, like, more expensive than uh, the other types of hosting. Also, he posts all the pictures. That's interesting. He said post. It's all on the servers. He said it in the video. I'm not posting. I need to verify that he actually said it. Well, I don't expect it to be much. It might just a site and Okay. Play the entire game for free. It does cost me some to host a site and transfer data. 
Okay. In the pictures, but I don't expect it to be much unless y'all blow this up. Here's the finished game. Logan charged three hundred dollars per egg. After you sign in, I give you enough coins to buy five. That's fifteen hundred dollars worth of eggs. It's not fifteen hundred dollars worth of eggs. For free. I know. I'm incredibly generous. I think it might be fun to turn this into an actual game you play using the cards that you have. Let me know if that's something you want to see, and if so, what you would want it to look like. Maybe something similar to Pokemon, or maybe. Okay. I mean, I don't know. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say that because he maybe maybe he's being genuine about it. I don't, I don't know. It it really does seem like it's just a cash grab, but I don't know. It it kind of gives me like yeah, cause the game is just like so so incomplete. But I don't know. Let's buy another egg, another zebra. Let me check this and see like where are all the. This organization of the spreadsheet is so confusing. Comment verified new breed. So here are the comments. Oh, so are these all of the ones that can be bred from each of these? Or is no, is that not it? Amon Huyer said Jake Paul versus Andrew Tate. Who gonna win? Uh yeah, my money's on Jake Paul, bro. Andrew Tate Andrew Tate's a, he's a, he's old, bro. I think that dude is like thirty something. Andrew Tate. I think they're doing boxing too, which Logan Paul has an advantage in boxing. This dude is 36, bro. He's old, bro. He's an old man. And I think Logan is like, what, 25 or something? Or not Logan. Um, Jake Paul. Let's see. Let's just check his age. Yeah, he's 25. So I would say I would say Andrew Tate is gonna uh, definitely get knocked knocked out. Okay, back to the back to the game. I need to do some breeding. Also, I I wish that the the U the U I could you could maybe organize your cards or something, uh, or if I could sort them, if there was a way to sort them by rarity, that would be nice for sure. Okay, so oh we can buy no we can't buy a new one. Okay, so let's let's breed. Hyped on the on the snyan. I'd say that's the best one. So hit breed. We'll breed the zebra and then what's another base animal we have? Wait, I have no other base animals. Oh, that's cringe. That's cringe. Okay, I see why people have to spend money on this game now. Because, like, bro, it's basically cookie clicker. Like, it's literally cookie clicker. Because you need to get so many more coins to uh, to unlock more eggs. And you can't burn them for some reason. Like, if you could burn them for their total daily yield, like, the game would move much faster. But he literally did not implement the, like, he didn't even add the mechanic. Yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Making changes to the game. That's tough. Okay. So yeah, at this point we're pretty much just waiting to get uh to get more. Oh no, I have a bear. Okay, sick. I didn't see that. So hit breed. Let me just make sure I don't have I haven't bred um these two together yet. Wait. Okay. So I have a Zorka, Greer, Fonda, Duranda, Pandorka, Forka. Okay. Good. I don't want to breed the same animal twice. Bear frog. What is the bear frog gonna be? Let's see if we can check in the thing. The other man said bear frog. Then he said, please breed bear frog. I don't I don't think I have the frog anymore. Cause bro, it's like the thing where oh jeez. That art. The art <laughs> The art is so bad. <laughs> what the fuck? It looks like a it looks like a baboon, bro. What the fuck? What the fuck? It does not even look like it. It does not even look like either. Fields man said, I want bear frog. Do what it takes. Fuck it. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm taking out my wallet, bro. We're spending the bag on this game, bro. The, f the art literally looks like a fucking baboon, bro. What? It doesn't even look like a a zebra or a bear. It literally looks like a fucking like a monkey. It looks like, wait, hold on. It looks like a snow baboon. I don't even know if that's what it's called. I'm not a, I'm not a zookeeper. It looks like a snow baboon. That's what it looks like to me. That's crazy. <laughs> this way I said, do what it takes. <laughs> All right. Time to rally the troops. All right, we got only 31 coins. So, right, back to, I don't know. Uh, I guess we can react. So, it looks like also he maybe did this. Like, he did, looks like he did this before. Which, I guess that makes sense. He made another game. Or this is maybe um, Merly Derp, who... There's another guy basically in the video who does some talking, and he's the one who made the the stable diffusion pictures. Um, 
Which I know I was roasting it, but like, bro, if you made that many pictures, I know it took a long time. Like, actually, that's pretty good. Uh, but I would say, I would say, I think that could be this guy. Okay. Wait, he said he remade the whole game. What the heck? Jeez. If you make something like this, you can't monetize it. Like you, you, you this is never gonna go on the app store, bro. You could put it online, but you could not put it on the app store. <laughs> he said it's fun. I swear I'm having fun. Felix Man said, find out how it is communicating the data and exploit it. I mean, I'm not gonna DDoS attack this dude on stream, but it would be it would be interesting, like if someone, if there are people who do like anonymous hacking on YouTube, I would definitely watch it. <laughs> he said it said bear frog. <laughs> I thought you would take down the thing. You're still talking about bear frog. All right, let's see. We got. Oh shoot, where'd the game go? They need to add a tab, bro. They need to add an icon. I don't like that they don't have an icon for it. Maybe I can go in and just add one. We'll make a we'll make a Chrome extension. Don't DDoS just find out. How it adds animals. Oh. Maybe if I used... If you know what Postman is, could I make a Postman request and see if it goes through? Okay, how do I send a fake request to it? That could be really interesting. Also, you could also just add one, like, via HTML. Okay, let's go to network. Postman? That's genius. Okay, should we try Postman? <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Hopefully, I still have Postman on my computer. Post. Tell me I have Postman. Let's go. The report to the big guy and claim one thousand dollars to get bear frogs. Yo, what if? What if instead of um, what if instead of sending a Postman request to get bear frog, we just get a million coins added to my account? Wait, could I? Nah, there's no way I could just. Nah, you can't just expect element and just add more coins that way, can you? That would be too easy. Nah, that would be too easy. Because it's going to pull your user data. It's not It's not going on based off what's stored here. Right? I couldn't just give myself 12,000 coins. Oh, that would have been cool. No, that's just dumb. That doesn't make sense. But I need to update Postman, but here's Postman. Amon Hurrier said, try it, bro. All right, bet. We're going to try to, we're going to try to do this. We're going to try to send a request. It's, it's yippee.com. Well, here's the thing. I don't know. Wouldn't a request like this need credentials? I, we'll see. Let's, let's go to network. Let's see what a, let's see what a normal request looks like. Uh, Felix Man said, you probably could do it on Postman. You would need to find out what API request looks like before you make it, then get unlimited coins. Yes. That's the plan, boys. We're going to try to get unlimited coins. All right. So let's see what an API request looks like. And I think we can do it on here. Here's the thing. I could either do it for one egg coin and maybe, okay, maybe instead of getting unlimited egg coins, we check the API request that gets us one egg. And then basically how it's going to work when you, when you send the API request, if it checks the number of coins, if we can send it in the, um, in the request body, then we could just have it say like a hundred coins each time or a thousand coins each time. And it would, should work, but it's pro it's proof. Wait, wait, what it's poorly made. I doubt they have a real API protections send like 100,000 times. I'm not blowing up his app, bro. That's, that's messed up <laughs> or just one. I will do it one coin multiple times. I'm not going to send. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not, I'm not going to blow up his fire ship account and burn all his money that he made from this but i will try to get free coins though that i don't care okay so once this gets to 100 i uh, will be able to check the network uh request over here in the chrome developer console oh you forgot, can't see it over here in the chrome developer console and it should give us some information about the api request which hopefully we can use to get the free coins okay Dude has to pay per request on Fireship. Just DDoS and boom. Give him give him a bill of like 100k. No, 
This has slowly gone from you wanting to get bear frog to literally just blow up the game. <laughs> Streamer blows up my game live on stream. That's what the poor kid gets. Uh, Felix Bennett said that his parents have to sell their house. <laughs> Felix Bennett ready to literally tear down this dude's life for bear frog. I don't know, bro. Let's see. All right, we'll grab these yields. Are we? Are we at 100? Nah, we're close. We're at 82, 82, 84. All right, we're six. We're 16 away. And then once we get to 16, we'll check the request and see what it looks like. Has blocked cookies. Okay, yeah, that's that's me. I blocked cookies. Has third party requests. Blah blah. blah. Interesting that there's no other request showing up when you harvest the coin. I wonder if that's just because it's felt. And the network doesn't show up. Because if this was React, each time you click, you would see a network. The front end would send it to the network. But because it's server-side rendering, do we not see anything? I'm going to have to look it up. How to check requests on Svelte. I don't know enough about this framework to check. Making API calls with Svelte. Let's read this. Could could we change the Could we change the scripting in it and then do it that way? Let's see. So here's how you send like a, a fetch request on mount. It goes to some API from some other website. And then you have your main business to check the code. All right, yeah, we'll check the code. Let's go back here. Grab this, grab this. Go to elements. And then it should be in the script, I think. So, all right, let's, it's it's hard because my uh, my developer console is like smaller. Okay. That gives me a little more space. So let's see. We've got we've got all these different scripts, and each one of them does what? App dot immutable asset. So uh, this is a layout. Purchase coin store. Oh, okay. Uh, what I think each of these are are these are the different views. I think. I think preload helper. Huh. No, these are style sheets. Actually, that was dumb. These are style. These are just C this is just CSS. I think. Yeah, this is just CSS. And then are these the different views then? Immutable chunks, preload helper. Uh I could just look it up. Too. Let me do that quick. Let's see what this is. Link types preload and then we'll do it for Svelte and we'll see what that is. Also, let's see what they said in the Discord. What the heck? Oh, uh, what do you coin up what do you do after that? Wait, what? No way someone else is doing the same thing as us. Or can you do that? Someone said VC if he wants. He can tell if he wants. I was waiting for you to realize I mean, NSX CSS with like a, like a little run a baby dweeb bear frog. Dude. Hey, bro. They got there first? Wait, are you saying that this is like the same thing? In that, you should see under request headers a field called authorization. This will have a long text, so that's the token. Huh. So how would we get the how would we get the token though? Or you can do it the other end. Someone said it in voice chat. He can tell if he wants to. Add that to Postman. Okay. Well, wouldn't you have to add? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me just go to Postman. Okay. So it'd be new request and it would go to, oh, he literally has the Firebase. Oh, that's sweet. Okay. So grab this. Do I need this last quote? No, I don't. Grab that. Delete this. Hold on. Let's just make a new tab. All right. Paste this. Is it, I think it's a post request, but we can just check here. Yeah. So it's post request. And then we also need to do some content type and then authorization. So grab this. The thing is, don't we need the long token? Don't we need to somehow get his token? Although if it is on the front end somehow, we could grab it. It is possible to grab it. Okay. So first key is going to be content type. And then you have to find out your bearer. I'm not sure what you mean by that. I'll, we'll figure that out in a second. And then the next is going to be authorization, which is going to be bearer long type. Okay. Although I'm not sure if these are supposed to be, no. Yeah, I, I messed up. These are supposed to be in the header section, not the body section. Let's paste this here, and then we'll paste this right below it. Okay. 
Next, we grab application JSON for type, put it there, and then we'll come back to grabbing the lawn token in a second. We're about to get a whole bunch of free coins. Let's go. <laughs> All right, let me just grab really quick. I'm going to harvest these coins because I don't know why not. I don't know why I'm still playing the game legit since at this point we're literally just hacking, but... All right, we'll grab this, grab this, grab this, grab this, grab this, grab a new egg, got an orca, no one cares. Go back, okay. All right, back to trying to get free coins. So open this up, make it really wide. All right. So Felix Mass said you have to find out your bear. Okay, so how do we grab the bear token to get, how do we grab the bear token? I Would it come from each application then? So from like a past request? That would be my guess, but I'm not sure yet. Okay, so back to the Discord. Okay, so then we need to add some stuff to the body, which is going to be, um, we want to do it in, not XML card, is it form data? No. Every account has its own bear. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. You just have to find yours. Okay, I'll just ask. I'll just literally ask in the Discord. Uh, or you can do that other way. He said in voice chat, he can tell if he wants to. Uh, how, how did you find your bear token let's ask i wonder wait is yippy not seeing this that people are doing this or or no does he just not care it seems like i don't know it seems like uh you you wouldn't want people in your discord literally posting how to get free coins uh yeah see look okay yeah they added like a massive energy value to the coins so we have Fusman said he'll fix it before it falls, but that's good. Also, let's make sure that I grab a screenshot of this too. In case uh Yippie just it's like he sees it in the Discord and deletes it. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna copy this. Because I'm gonna copy this and just send it to you. So that way we each have it. Let's go. Go back here quick. Go here. I think if you use backticks, you can have like a nice code. Oh, I forgot. I have like a weird I have like a weird keyboard that doesn't have backticks. So I add two back ticks. Okay. I just sent you the I just sent you the code just so we have like another um so we have like another copy of it. Just so that way in case he does get deleted um from the Discord, we we still have it later on. Cause this this is this ain't over, Yippie. We're getting free coins, bro. Alright. So do we want to do it as form data, I guess? I guess we do it as form data. Even though for some reason it says body JSON not stringify. So are each of these key value pairs then do we start with update or how does each feel how does each feel work? Huh. Wait, wait, wait. I have a better way to do this. I have a way better way to do this. Fuck postman, dude. Let's just make a JavaScript file and we'll just have the JavaScript file send the fetch request. That makes way more sense. Let me open VS Code. Actually, let me just open a new terminal window. And I'll just make a new JavaScript file, and we'll just execute the file, and it'll just send the fetch request. That would be way smarter. Okay, go to desktop. Uh, how call hack.js. <laughs> Touch. Hack.js. Oh, and they got back to me in the Discord. Okay, sick. So now let's do open uh, hack.js. Okay. Oh, no, not in there. We want to do code hack.js. Okay. So that'll open it up in VS Code. Uh, open up our nest file, hack.js. Then we can just go. Felixman said, okay, here's the situation. On Firebase, he'll be able to see a large amount of coins. So he'll give you, he'll give you yourself like 10K coins. Otherwise, he'll flag it and delete your coins and ban your account. No shot. <coughs> how do you know he'll ban how do you know he'll uh, he'll ban the account or see it in Firebase? Like is he is he like actively monitoring the Firebase or no? Okay. Also, th <laughs> this street this stream has literally gone from I just know he'll do that. All right, Felix Man said I've ran Firebase. Okay. Oh, dude, what's funny is <laughs> this has gone from uh, uh, playing Logan Paul's game to hacking Logan Paul's game so fast. If he has any brain cells, he'll do that. All right, let's find out. <laughs> Shout out Reddit dweeb. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was legit one of the funniest things I heard this morning Bro said, bro said You're reading a fucking reddit weave That was funny I mean 
I, I mean, no, no hate to people on Reddit, bro. I'm on Reddit too. And, and I'm definitely in the comments, but like, that was funny. Okay, so where did the code go? Let's see. I'm gonna switch it on my keyboard. Okay, sick. So it is on my keyboard. Let's make a function. And I think this is how you do this, but we'll just make an inline function and we'll call it uh, uh, function. I'll just make a basic one. Although I kind of want to make an inline function, but I forgot how to do inline JS function. Hold on. Inline JS function. I just forgot what the syntax looks like. I just think it looks cleaner, even though it, it really doesn't matter. Actually, you know what? If it doesn't matter, let me not do it. So grab the fetch request, put it in the function, give it a name, call it hack. Go down here, call it. And then I guess if you run this, then it should send the request. But oh yeah, we need to grab the bearer token first. So let's go back to the Discord really quick and see how he said to do that. He said, scroll down and it should be within that header. Hold on. Oh, he also has his own bearer token. Okay, so under headers, under document.commit. Uh, let's see. Uh, it would be, hold on. Where's the game? And then go to network. And then, oh, I wonder why for me it's not showing up. Unless it wasn't network. Unless I did not read that post right. Or did not read the Discord right. Let's see if it actually is under network. It's under, yeah, network. And then he's under hidden. Wait, what? Why does mine not show up? Unless I, I know I closed something on Chrome. Hold on. Oh, my bad. I see the webcam died. I have another battery. One second. Okay, one second, one second. Getting the webcam back online. Okay. All right, all right, all right. So wait, I don't, I don't see why it's not showing up. Why the network request is not showing up? As far as like the DOM stuff that was pasted in the Discord. Hold on. Just gotta fix this camera. Okay, and I also gotta, I gotta put the charger, uh, the other battery for the camera back on the charger. Back to our regular schedule hacking. We need to. All right, we need to figure out how to get this um, get this network request. So it seems like it it seems like he said to go under network, but for some reason there's nothing there. Scroll down and here, and it should be within header. Okay. So back to the game and under header. Let's see size. Phillipsman said, I'm in contact with Jax. Okay, sweet. Getting personal support, <laughs> LOL. Yeah, we, we need tech support. We need, <laughs> we need tech support. We need to get free coins, bro. What's interesting is my my Chrome dev tools are not showing up. If I, maybe if I enable cookies. Oh, I okay. All I had to do was enable cookies. Okay. So now let's go and see which under which header it was under. I'm not going to scale my account like that slightly, not too much to get flagged. Yeah. I'm only going to do like a slight 10,000 coins, you know, nothing too crazy. <laughs> uh, let's see. So it would be under documents, documents commit, but it looks like there's multiple ones, but I don't know if that matters. So, all right, back to, back to the game, back to here. And it would be under, can I, can I search it by keyword documents? No, I can't. Okay. Whatever. It's, is it alphabetical? Nope, not alphabetical. Um, let's see. Jack said you can get yourself as many coins as you like. Already talked to talked with the creator. Okay, sweet. That's good then. If he doesn't care, that's 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 good. I'm just trying to uh, Jackson. I'm just right now. I'm trying to find um, 
where the where the bear would be. Now I don't see the like the document.commit folder under network, so I'm not sure yet. Uh, let's see. Uh, long bear. If it's any of these, Dillsman said it's gonna. Is he gonna patch it? Uh, I assume it's not a question to me. Uh, next out spell. Request. Plot origins. Content type. Cache type. Cell date. Nothing here. Let's see. Start. They said click on the one of the animals and a, and a new request should show up. Okay. Click on the animals. Um. What the heck? I'm dumb. I didn't see it. Ah, unless it's the request headers and it's under here. In that case, it would be the documents commit. Okay. Ah, okay, this then? And then it would be token longer. Wait, I gotta read what it said exactly. And I'm looking for headers bear long token. Okay. Back to here. Sorry, coding actually like takes up like brain space. Like it's hard to like talk in codes. We have request headers. Okay, sweet. So here it is then. I think it's this, bro. I assume I assume it's this. I assume it's that right there. So I should go in. I should be able to go in back to VS Code and then paste this. Yep, that's it. Okay, sweet. Let's go. All right, let's get free coins, free coins. All right, so take this. We'll call it uh, let uh, long token. Also, no need to. Ch also, you need to change the names. I'm not sure which names you're talking about. I need to change the names of coins and eggs. Also, we don't want to do 10 million, right? I don't think you want to do 10 million. I think I'll just do like. That is probably good enough. Name, name of token. Ah, okay. What's the name of the token? What would the name of the token be then? It would be name, name of token. Unless it would be like the name of my account or or is it uh all the coins or load of. Is that what it's talking about? I'm not sure. I'll just check and make sure if it's not under the headers. You can find that in the same place you found the bear. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, yeah, it would be post accept request headers, content length. Click on, click if you click view source. So source. Jax, he's going to wipe ev everyone, even people like Lud. Lud's, Ludwig said he spent money on the game, at least according to like what he posted in the comments. He said he spent three hundred forty dollars on the game, so that's interesting. But okay, let's see. Wait, where did you get the where did you get the bear? Felix Bennett, I got the I got the bear from. I clicked on one of the coins, and then a request appeared like towards the bottom of the screen for documents dot something, and I got it from there. Okay, so if you click view source, everything will be wiped, but every purchase will be brought over. Is there like another game coming or something? Okay, let's see. Back to trying to find this name thing. So we have index. Nah, it can't be this. Target path session. No, not this. This is just like the source of the app. Unless I need to grab like this. No, nah, I feel like I'm lost here. Is the, is the, is the, uh, hold on, let's read what you said. So Jack's here, you said, if you change the names, I'll send another pick in the Discord. Discord two seconds. Okay, sweet. Yeah, that helps. He said you also need to change the names. Name name of token. Huh. Yeah, we'll do that in a second. <laughs> Felix Man said, "Is it supposed to just be headers?" Um, I think there's. I think there's a body to the request too, because that would be like the uh, the actual like coins. I think so. This would be a funny stream highlight. I ha I hacked Logan Paul's new game. <laughs> but credit to um Yippie though, 
that video is actually like good like like good thumbnail good um like good pacing i clicked on it pretty fast dude i can't find the bear oh he said sent it it's at the, for me it's like all the way at the bottom if you if you click networks and then you scroll down and towards the name okay let's see so under payload okay oh i see what you mean so you go to i'll just do a new request so back to the game uh go to network or i guess uh, maybe i don't need to view source and then name name of token uh, i'm too lazy to i'm just gonna copy this go to word counter is there a json formatter json formatter online maybe this will help No. Uh, no. Beautify. Okay. Sweet. That was easy. Okay. Let's find. Um. So name. Coins. This one doesn't have. So the first name goes in the field name, and the field. So the first name goes in the field name, and the field, and the other is the one further down in the script. So name would be this. So I assume you're saying like name, this is name, and then instead of name of token, it would be this string right here. So grab that and then paste it here. Delete. Delete that. Go back over here. The second name is this other string. So grab this. Back to VS Code. Go to the bottom, not the bottom, like right here. Okay, delete this, paste that. Like that? Jack Shooty said yes? Okay. I'm gonna try to send the request then. Big moment, big reveal moment. Also, I'm surprised how like this actually happened much quicker than I thought it would. Okay, so let's go to the desktop and then let's run hack.js. Okay. The Fetch Supervising Experimental Feature requested time trace warnings. All right, I don't know if it worked. Let's see. Doesn't look like it. Yo, <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Oh, we got 10. Wait, how many coins is that? Uh, 300,000. Yo, we have 100 million coins. We're rich. We're rich. Wait, why did the egg price go back to one? That's interesting. Wait, can I just spam eggs now? Let's go. <laughs> we did it. We did it. Bro, I can make I can make literally as many I can make I could literally beat the game like right now. That's amazing. It resets to that as well. Okay. I assume that's because maybe there's something in it in the uh the request that would reset it. If you look at the script, base TWL said W. Yes, bro, we did it. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. All right, grab these yield. Wait, we don't even need to grab the yield anymore. We can just spam eggs until we make each animal. Dude, wow, the price goes up pretty quick. I wonder how long it would take to uh, to actually beat the game itself. Also, maybe it's possible too to delete some of these animals. Okay, let's grab, let's make the lion bear first. So hit breed. And then let's also breed it with, I wanna breed it with a frog. And we can make the bear frog. Yo, bear frog. <laughs> I, I actually legit, I forgot why we were even doing this in the first place. The whole reason is because Felix Ben said he wanted to get a bear frog. So, yeah, at this point, uh, uh, Felix Ben said, Malik, DM me your script on Discord. I'll change the bear. Okay, sweet. Yeah. All right. Let me grab this. You, oh, shoot. Did I just close Discord or uh, VS Code? Yeah, I did. Uh, okay, hold on. I'll send you this. Yeah, I'll send you the script. Um. What was I going to say about the, oh, I don't know if you need to change the, um, what's it called? If you need to change the name stuff, but probably not, but maybe, I don't know. Let's see. We have to find hack.js. Oh, let's just open a new terminal window. Go to the desktop, CD desktop, and then open the new terminal window. Wait, Jax, you said you do. So are you saying that you do need to, uh, change, 
I assume you're. I assume you're saying you need to change the uh, the names. Each name has a unique unique name for each person. Ah, okay, gotcha. So let's go to. Yeah. Okay. So I assume that's like each unique uh, Firebase endpoint, then, right? Be something like that. So. So CD to my desktop. And then let's open Hack.js. Okay, great name, great file name. Felix said, "Ah, uh, how do you find it then?" Yes. Okay, Felix, I'll I'll go through a walkthrough really quick then on how to find it. So let's just do Command A. No, hold on, let me delete this stuff first. So delete the bear token. Actually, you know whatever. Double click this. Okay, delete that. Delete some of that. All right, just make sure you delete some of this stuff. So do command A. Alright, back over to Discord. It's great that this is just in the Discord too. Like like literally like all you would have to do to join the game. Alright. Also I'm gonna say that if the creator um because we were talking earlier in the stream about if if we thought that this was a cash grab too. Um if the creator is literally posting and allowing it in the Discord on how to get free coins, that kind of makes me think that it's maybe not a cash grab and maybe I was wrong. But I don't know. Cause at this point, like, bro, anyone could do this like so easily if you knew like one percent about coding. But all right, hold on. Let me send you this really quick. Hold on. All right, paste it in. Um, your message is too long, bro. Discord's got to be trolling, bro. Two thousand character limit. Uh, okay. Feels. I'm just gonna. Uh, feels. I'm just gonna paste it in, in a notion in like the notion doc. Because that could work too. Hold on. Go back to Notion. I'm doing it on my other screen, guys. That's also why you can't see it on screen. Let's see where Notion is. Open it up. I'm putting it in uh, just like the main Malik Latte doc. And it's at the bottom. Okay. It's at the bottom of the, of the, of the, uh, the Notion doc. Okay. Back to stream. Jack said... Wait. Jack said... Don't have the you don't have the bear exclamation point. I'm not sure what you mean by don't have the bear exclamation point. Jack said else he can get access to your game account. Ha! Huh? Wait, why would he not have access to the game account anyways? If he's if he's the one managing the Firebase, like, which is I don't know for people who maybe aren't calling the coding, the Firebase is where the actual game is like stored in the cloud. Why would he not have access to everyone's account in general? Like, wouldn't you expect the game manager to have that or no? Maybe I don't know enough. I don't know. And then Jack's, Jack's Cutie said, remove the bear from the script you sent. I didn't, I was too lazy to remove the whole uh, bear. I just deleted like a couple lines of it. And then the guy, the guy you sent the script to, that'd be Felix Bennett. He did remove the bear. Oh, okay. I did not see that. Yeah. All I did was like delete a couple lines just so like, uh, I don't get like a random requests. Even though I don't really think Felix Bennett would do that, but I don't know. Anyways, back to the game. Now that we're rich, now that we've hacked the game, we can get any animal we want. This is lit. We have, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to make the uh, the bear frog. Oh, there's an elk? Oh, that's tough. No shot. And there's a turtle. Yeah, dude, look how many, look how many, like, bears we would have had to gone through. If I was playing this game the easy way, the regular way, the non-hacked way, I would have had to go through and literally get so many fucking bears and just other random animals I wouldn't want. Felix Bennett said, also, I'm not sure if he trusts me with his real zoo account. I That's going to get wiped anyways. <laughs> True. I guess it, I guess it doesn't really matter, bro. If you want, if you want the, the account token, you can have it. I suppose it doesn't really matter. That's a, that's a valid point. Let's make, let's make bear frog. Let's grab the frog. Hit breed. Go up to the top. That is that is hideous. That's a face only a mother could love, bro. Fry on. <laughs> That's tough. I wonder uh, what the actual like combat would look like in the game like this. Would they balance it based off the way animals actually fight in real life, like? For example, like, would, a, would anything that's just, like, a bear automatically win? Because, like, that's basically, like, the strongest animal, I think. As far as I know, it's, like, I think stronger than a lion. So, would that just be, like, that one just automatically, like, wins? Or how would how else could they add it in? I guess, like, a, 
a zebra or like or not like a snebra would have like a ton of attack maybe and then wouldn't be able to defend itself i don't know plus like are all yeah i don't know if so it, would the game just work that if you just have like the ultra rare ones you just automatically win like how would how would you make this balanced and like actually fun that i don't know check discord really quick crazy that that's just in their discord bro did not see that coming like we were literally talking about hacking the game and then someone and like you just posted that was clutch yippee servant oh that's cringe dude <laughs> we leave him here turbulent and holy peace stuck in voice chat <laughs> uh okay why did this game just open back up i don't know if anyone else saw it it literally closed and opened but oh the borka wait when did i breed that i don't know Oh, my, my Chrome is crashing. It sucks. Let me see. I need to reset this. Okay. I'm not sure why Chrome is, like, so zoomed out. At least on my end, it is. I can probably just close developer tools. Uh, I don't know. No idea what's going on. Close that. Close that. Oh, this is literally a screenshot. I'm dumb, bro. It's a screenshot. <laughs> I'm dumb. <laughs> I was so confused for a second. Okay. Anyways, let me open this up. Jack said check Discord general. Okay. Let's see. What is this? What what channel is this? Are are wait, are you sending me like a Discord link to join something or no? ACBS join Discord. I'm confused. If this is a link to join something, like should I join it? Should I join the Discord? Is that what you're talking about? Felix Bennett said also, Felix Bennett said also, I'm like, sure he, I'm sure he trusts me with his real zoo account. Yeah, that was funny. Okay, let's, let's go back and let's keep, let's finish breeding these. Let's, 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 let's keep breeding these. So we have some zebras, some orcas, some snakes. Oh, just redirect to the announcements. You asked what they had planned. Okay. Announcements. Okay. So social links do appear to be out of the header page, making cards. Sortable at aqua rarity. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, I was talking about this earlier in stream. Like, right now, there's, like, no way to sort the animals, which is, like, a little annoying. Um, but then you kind of stuck with just everything, like, the way you bought it. Let's also react to this. Add reaction. I, I, dude, I wonder who's Yippie servant is. Like, that's crazy. Oh, wrong reaction. I'll just do that one. Okay. Social links can be added to the header page. I'm not sure why would you add social links. Um, so you can fix a login. I'm not sure. Burning cards will be re-added to the game. I wonder why they removed it. A message will show when you have already found that hybrid. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Um, a message will be shown when you already have that hybrid. Encouraging the discovery of all hybrids. Yeah, that's kind of the goal is to catch them all. Dude's man said, dude, my thing isn't working. No. Wait, Malik, if I send you my script, can you troubleshoot it for me? Yeah, yeah I will. I'll troubleshoot it for you, bro. Client, client exploits will be working away. We will not happen. We'll be slowly worked away. We will not happen in the move. UI update, cleaning up and refining the look of all sections. Setting the cap to 24, the yield cap to 24 hours. I wonder what the, uh, the yield cap means. That means like there's a limit to how much each one can yield. Making default breedable animals differently to hybrids already bred. Yo, that's, that, okay, this update at the bottom, that's huge. Even I would say even more important than like the UI and all this other stuff, you need to make it so like you can keep breeding animals. Like after it becomes one type, like it shouldn't stop there. The game should be like you should continue to be able to breed it. Like the the forca or whatever the other one is called, and for example like the bear frog, like those two need to be able to be bred into something like even crazier. I feel like that just adds like so much more to the game. But all right, let me check. Let me check if it feels like I sent the. Just let me know when you sent it. I'm assuming are you gonna send it in the Notion? I guess, yeah, because you can't send it in, um, nah, looks like you send it over Discord. All right, let's see. Oh, uh, let's see. Holy shit, I'm in it. I didn't have a function. Oh, okay. <laughs> My bad, I did not mean to post that. Aw, <laughs> uh, classic coding moment, bro. Should we drop a follow, too? Let me drop a follow on Yippie. Drop a follow. All right, back to, back to the Discord. 
All right, I'm just gonna keep. I'm just gonna keep breeding animals. I feel like I. Just instead of wait, Malik, if you could send it troubleshoot. Okay. Yeah, gotta have it in the in the in the function and then call it. Old JavaScript stuff. So Snion, Snorka, Garrett, Pandorka, Forka. So I guess the most efficient way to do this is to start from the top and to breed down. So make sure that they all get eliminated. So let's go from turtle. Dude, the UI is so cringe. I'm literally clicking it. Turtle. Okay, I'll refresh the page. Okay, so now I click turtle. Felix Man said, oh, it's still not working. I'll send it to you in Discord. Okay, yeah, send it to me in the Discord. I'll troubleshoot it. No guarantees, but yeah, I'll try. If you want to, I can send it. I can do it um, through hack.js too. Like I can just um, do it through that file or I can just do it in hack.js, download the file, and then send you the file too after troubleshooting it. That, that's probably actually the best way to do it, I think. Ra yeah, actually, you no, know I probably should have done that the first time too instead of like copy and pasting the text. Um, I should have just sent it as the file because like sometimes weird character stuff can happen when you're coding. Um, but I don't know, dude. This game is being weird. Okay, finally it worked. So hit breed. Hit breed. And we'll breed it. Okay. This this absolute monster. Uh, Turbra. All right. Felix Bennett said, yeah, just send, just send it to me. Um, I sent you on Discord. Okay. Yeah, I'll just do that. So here is the code. And then we have the bearer, the post, function hack. Grab all this. Copy it. Delete it. Back to VS Code. Open up VS Code. Let's make a new file so we can compare the two. And we'll call it, uh, what, hack2? Nice, original. Hack2.js. Okay. Open that up. Code hack2. It's probably going to open it up in a new, new window, but that's okay. No, it didn't. Oh, shoot. That's close it. Okay. So, hack2. So now I'll paste in the code that you sent me and then now let's see. Okay. So 10 million. Um, oh, did you, okay. So first, did you update the projects one? Let's check. So project I do dash default. Okay. Yeah. So that looks like it's been updated. So let's check the second name field. So this has also been updated. Um, let's see. So bearer dot, it looks like there's a typo in your bearer. Does it need to have a dot here? Maybe. Application, content type, headers. Let's try it. Let's just try to call it. I'm gonna try to call it or I guess not. We agree that's not that's not it, but let's see. I'll send you the file really quick. So plus upload file. Okay, send it to you on Discord and let's find hack. Hack two. Alright. I sent I sent you a version of hack two. I think it could be that that there was supposed to be a die here. Um Cause that's what I have on mine. Mine comes with a dot, and I assume that would be similar. You said try to call it. Okay. Node hack two. Let's see. Let me know if that works. Yeah, I tried to call it. <laughs> I think the, the the highlight video for this stream is gonna be called "I hacked Logan Paul's game." <laughs> that's funny. Did it work? Let's find out. Bro, now that I have, now that I'm infinitely rich in this game, like, I don't want to be like the game ruined it, but like, it's kind of like, you know, like if you play like an emulator game, or something, and you just get all like the tokens, it kind of like defeats the point of the game. Or if you played like, I don't know, I haven't played like too many games, so I don't have like a great example, but I think maybe like FIFA, when I used to play FIFA, and like my player, and I maxed it out. Just said it didn't work, huh? Okay, what else could it be then? Um, let's see, let's zoom out. I don't know, like I was saying though, when you max, when you like max out a game, it becomes like less fun. So, did I call it? I do call the function. Oh no, this is hack. Oh, there's still no function call on hack. Okay, let's go back. Let's grab hack two, paste it. So now we're actually calling the function. That was a mistake. Hack and then 
I will also console log something. And we'll just console log test. Okay. Let's try this now. All right, now it actually sent the, wait, it got a 401 request invalid credentials OAuth2 access token. See, that was because I added a dot. So it could now have been that this was wrong. So let's go back up, call it again. In experience. Okay, I think it worked, bro. I think it I think it worked. Oh, I forgot you can't you guys can't see the terminal answer the terminal down here. So yeah, like I said, the first so the first call got a 401, and I think that might have been because I added the dot to your bear token up here. Based on my bear token, it was just a guess. So since that didn't work, um I removed it and then I just resent it the request without it. And then I also added the function call down here and then a random console log. Because why not? I just want to make sure. Those men said didn't work, huh? Um, let's see. The feature could change at any time. Try wait, try refreshing your page too. Refreshing the game. See if that works. Also, is this my token? Like the token that I sent you? Like did you actually grab like the bear token and the the other one? Um, like the name and stuff? Assuming you did that, like, assuming you did that, it should work now, but. Should I have? Yeah. Okay, still didn't work. Um. Huh. The Fetch API is an experimental feature. Yo, what if we. <laughs> what if we hacked Yippie's account? <laughs> we, brought, we brought Yippie's tokens down to zero. Oh, uh, let's see. No, it's mine. Okay. Huh. So, what else did we have to change? Nothing else. So, coins. Coins, eggs. Um, so we have the Firebase count. We have rights. We have the body of the JSON request, which is from this array. Um, shoot. I guess I'll try adding the dot again. But now with the updated version, maybe that'll work. Not nah, 401. That's wrong. Oh, let's see. Authorization. Is it actually called authorization? Yeah, it is. And we have content type. Do you have the method? Um. Huh. What is the integer value for hack two? Okay, this energy value was set to one on mine. I'm gonna try doing that. Okay, that sent that sent another request. I changed the energy value for eggs to see if that helped. Exits dot true. <laughs> we're just we're just blowing up his Firebase account. I mean, bro, in theory, like if you literally wrote a script, like, okay, look, if I if I were to just write, like, look, I'm not going to do this, guys. I would never do this because I don't really need, like, there's no reason to do something like this. Like, that's just mean. But, like, if I were to just make, a, like, a while loop and do something like this and just throw that in there, I don't know how Firebase works, but could something like this just make, like, a million requests? So his Firebase account, basically until my computer crashes or until hack crashes. Um, Felix Man said, nope, still nothing, huh? I don't know. It seems like, yeah, it seems like this would be something that you'd want to do. Jack said, only one way to find out. <laughs> nah, bro, I can't do it, bro. I, f I feel like that's just, bro, that's just, like, bro, I would do it. I would do it if it was, like, a big corporation like Target or Walmart or I don't really care. But, like, this is literally just, like, some dude on the internet. And, like, if someone were to do that to me for, like, Easy Write or something that I'm working on, I would be so pissed. And, like, that's just, like, malicious. But I don't know. Felix <laughs> feel like Spence, I'll do that later. All right. Well, let me know. Let me know in the Discord. He <laughs> said, I'm going to make, like, 10 servers. All right, bro. Uh, that's funny. That's actually funny. I don't know. There, I've... There, 
There's nothing to gain, bro. There's nothing to gain from doing that. All right, back to troubleshooting this, bro. Cause I want to make sure you get you, if this. If this can work. So you have slash currency coins. Let's just make sure that these endpoints are right. That each one is pasted in the right one. So the first one is. Hold on. What am I doing? So the first one is at the top, which is going to be name, and it's going to be slash animals, so slash players and stuff. So, all right, I think the name, I think the names are wrong. I think the names are wrong. So, for this one, for the first name, I have projects slash zoo, and it goes into this database and it grabs like my actual like player name. But for the way that you grabbed it here. My name might be wrong. Yeah, that's also what I'm thinking. For the way that it's grabbed here, it looks like it's grabbed the currency slash coins. So I'll show you how to grab the name stuff again. So if you're in your Chrome DevTools, Jack said you have to alike. First name is wrong. Yeah, I think that's what we figured out. So if you're in your Chrome DevTools and you click one of them and it makes a new commit down here, click on that commit. Oh, hold on. Let me just make sure you can actually see this. Hold on, hold on. Okay. So like I was saying, so if you click on one of these requests and you make a request, down here you hit documents.commit and then instead of headers, go to payload right there. So it's click on one of these, get the request, go from headers to payload, and then from there, your name is going to be in this JSON, which you can open up. I don't know why there's two. Updates, name, yeah. So it's here. I think the way I did it though is I copied it and then I put it into like some weird JSON parser thing that I found online. I don't know, not parser, but yeah, yeah. It was this website, right? Where'd it go? Not this Bing. Was it this? Uh, no, it was not this. Okay, yeah. Uh, this JSON formatter.org, which helps you read it. Uh, what do I click on to get the name? Okay, so it feels better to. What you do to click, get the name is. In the game, um, you open up your Chrome DevTools, uh, either right-click Inspect Element or Shift-Command-I, and then make a request. And the way you do that is by clicking on one of the yields. Scroll down to the last yield right at the bottom, click it, and then under headers, like to the right of headers, you see payload, and it's going to be in this JSON object right here. The name will be right there. Yeah, somewhere in there. That's pretty much how you do it, I think. And then that should be replaced in for, um, for the, also if you want, I could, I can resend the file too. I, yeah, I'll, I'll just do that. I'm going to resend you the file, um, that has like the actual like request in it with the function. So just upload file and then I'll resend you hack to hack to dot JS. Felix Bennett said it shows me images in there. Wait, what? How does it show you images? Do you want to live stream on Discord and I can troubleshoot it from your end? How does it show you images? That's weird. I think if you do I have to make a new channel in our Discord to like make the to make it have um what's it called? To make it have like a live streaming section, because I don't know, I don't know how they did it. If you can just do it in like the voice channel. Wait, let's see. Open chat. Incoming call. Okay. Let's see. No, I don't want to share my screen. Let's see. So your screen. How do I make this? How do I make this bigger? That's the question. Pop out, maybe. Okay. All right. To so zoom in, I'm gonna mute myself. All right, so, so click and make a new request. So refreshes, uh, click, click like the Fox. Yeah. Click the, click the Fox. Oh, I forgot the stream is asynchronous. My bad, bro. I forgot. I forgot the stream is asynchronous. Yeah, click the click the fox. All right, 
let's see. Okay, and then scroll down to the last documents commit. Um, under name. Why doesn't it say sources for you? Huh, that's weird, bro. It doesn't say sources. Wait, I have to check. Where would it be on? Where would it be on my end? Um, let's see. Shoot, I just closed it on accident. Eggs going for six bands. That's crazy. Okay, so it would be network. Click this documents document. Wait. I'm confused, bro. For your Chrome Dev Tools, source is not showing up. I might have to search up how to find that. Cause like when you click it. Check payload, maybe. Or is it under headers and then source? It could be that. So network. Oh, it's payload, not source. So yeah, click payload. Check cord. I send it to you. Uh, I assume you mean Discord. Just as a Discord. Rights name. Okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take this and put it in the JSON parse. J I keep saying parser. The JSON formatter. Yeah, JSON formatter. Paste that in. Let's do. Okay, let's grab the name for the first one. Then let's go back over to VS Code. Go here. Did I copy? Wait, did I copy this? I need to check if I copied the actual. Uh, yeah, okay, I copied the quotation marks. All right, paste that in, back to the JSON parser. Go back down here, grab the other name. Wait, copy this. Go back to VS Code, back to VS Code, and then paste it in for the other name. Oh, I copied it, shoot. Okay, open up the terminal and then go CD into the desktop. And then also weird that uh, VS Code, normally the integrated terminal should open up with like your current directory. I don't know why it's not doing that. So CD desktop and then node. Oh, shoot, that was hack.js. I did it for the wrong file. Dang it. Okay, hold on. I have to, I have to update this again. So go back to the first one, paste it in. All right, back to here to the JSON parser, back up top, grab the first name, grab that. Okay. Copy it back to VS code. Go to the first name again, paste it. No, that seems wrong, bro. I think I'm messing it up. I'm trying to use all hotkeys. Shoot, is that wrong? Hold on. I just got to use my mouse for a second. Okay. Copy this. Unless that's right, but... Okay, copy this for the first one. All right, paste it. Go back to the first one. All right, copy that again. Shoot, where'd it go? All right, back to VS Code. Um, go to the first one. All right, paste it. Okay. All right, we're gonna run the command. We'll see if this works. All right, 403. Missing your in-person permissions denied? Wait, what? Wait, why? Hold on. I need to say, I just gotta like full screen VS code for a second and then actually like lock in. So we have, so I think, I feel like this name is still just wrong. So I'm gonna delete that first. And I'm pretty sure this name is also wrong. 
So I'm going to delete that too. Okay. Then go to the JSON parser and just do format again. And then I'm assuming that I grab these rocks. So grab this and paste it up here at the top. I think this is the wrong code still. Or I think this is the wrong name. I think. I could be wrong though. This first name seems to be wrong. Name project.player.u slash currency slash coins. I don't know why it seems like it's still wrong. I need to check. Name. Let's check again. All right, we're going to call it. Node hack two. All right, it says it's on the request. So hopefully that worked. It said it's an invalid request. My bad that the copying and pasting. It worked. Let's go. We're rich. We're rich. Dude, let's go. Oh my gosh. Dude, gotta gotta pour up for that victory. Let's go. Someone make <laughs> someone send me a code. I'm gonna make a loop. Nah, you're cr I'm not doing that on stream. So we do it? <laughs> I'll do screen screenshot it and make it live. Okay, we're uh uh, uh let the record show Malik Latte never broke anyone's Firebase account. Um if this does happen, it happened off stream. I don't I didn't know about it. Uh that's all I have to say. But I have I have no involvement with with what happens. I don't, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do it. I don't I don't know. That's good though. We are now officially rich in. We are rich in realzoo.com. Take that, Logan Paul. <laughs> Send the code to Loop Town. No, you could write your own loop. I'm not assisting in any of this. I, I have nothing to do with this. Just send the code. <laughs> no, you can Google how to make your own loop. <laughs> Har I, we don't even need to harvest this. We can just spam buying eggs. Just spam buy eggs now. Look at... Oh, you can't see the request. Just send the code, LOL, not loop. Oh, okay. I'll send you the code. Where did Discord go? Okay. So back to hack two. Jeez. Copying and pasting literally took so much out of me, bro. I don't know how. All right, so... We need to go to plus, upload file, go back to hack two, legendary name for a file, hack two. Okay, send the hack two file over. All right, what you do with this code has nothing to do with me. If you use this to hack his Firebase account, that's on you. Uh, I have nothing to do with, I have nothing to do with that. Um, uh, peace between Yippie uh, and I, I, I didn't, has nothing to do with me. This is, this is against Logan Paul, bro. This is beef for Logan Paul. All right, let's see. So, there looks like there's another a a announcement. Also, let's check general. I really want to know if he keeps, if he's just gonna keep the free coin hack in the Discord. Uh, cause I would not be surprised if it gets deleted like quick. Yeah, I think it's gone already. Let's hope Yippie is rich, <laughs> bro. He's gonna get. He's getting rich off of this off this game. Wait, Jack. Jack said you got some explaining to do. I mean, if you could decide the passionate rant on earlier on hating Logan and voice, hating Logan in voice chat, much of the post has been. I mean, as much as these people, as much as these people want to hate Logan Paul, bro, you would not have made any money from this game if Logan Paul didn't do it like what Logan Paul did. I don't, I don't even mean like scam. I just mean like his content. Like, if he wasn't a content creator, bro, there would be no game. There would be no real zoo.coin. Like. His concept of even coming up with CryptoZoo, you can thank him for making your game because none of this idea would even exist without him. So, like, as much as you want to hate, bro, it's like, I don't know. I feel like there's more to it than that. But, dude's man said, let's hope Yippie is rich. He's getting rich, bro. 3,000 IQ move. Didn't taste or tase a rat or something. Yeah, he actually did tase a rat. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> Literally, what? I got searched on Logan for a gift. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. 
Dude, the the crazy thing is the hat, bro. The hat is crazy. Wait, OpenAI has a uh, custom. Wait, you can there's custom uh, emotes with or emojis with OpenAI. I didn't know that. I'm in their Discord. That's sick. I'm just gonna send them. A, I'm just gonna send the crying emoji. Anyways, we'll see. So we have he's logged into the game, stole the artwork as an NFT, and now he's looking for update ideas for his proper game. Well, this is not true. This is not, I don't, at least I watched the Kavizilla documentary, bro. As far as I'm concerned, I don't think he actually stole the, stole the artwork. I thought he just used like, um, like free images. Dark times. You have your major update to the discord and you still ain't sleep. Ain't slept, bro. Ah, yes. YouTube apocalypse. Oh yeah. The YouTube apocalypse. This makes sense because now people are joining from that, that video that came out, that big video they released. So it's kind of like, um, if you know about like 2B2T or like other Minecraft servers, like once they start posting on YouTube and getting big on YouTube, a lot of the servers get messed up. There's like a big influx of players comes in. Uh, but yeah, some interns. Are you are you doing Discord updates? Girls grind. And then people just send in some more stuff. Dude, the, the Forka, that uh, looking zesty. <laughs> you'll get the Zorka, you'll like it. <laughs> That's all yours. Anyone got an Epic? ton of people i have not gotten an epic yet should i keep going with the free coins we have now now that i'm rich in this game i could i could try to keep going now and try to get an epic i think the best one that i have is a rare can you also can you get are there any uh rare or are there any epics that are bases i don't know oh shoot could probably just leave this call hey is that a loop <laughs> yo <laughs> nah I'm close. I'm closing this, bro. I'm blind to this. I have nothing to do with that. I'm leaving this stream. <laughs> I did, I literally, I literally opened Felix Benz Discord. There's literally like he's literally like writing the loop to just absolutely blow up the firebase. That's hilarious. Uh, bro. At least like, bro. Nah, I'm not wanna like give advice on how to hack, but like maybe hide your IP address. And when you do that, maybe use a VPN. Um, yeah. Maybe don't make the request from your home computer would be another uh, advice. Like, do it from, uh, do it remotely somehow. I'm not exactly sure how that would work, but yeah. Okay. So now that we're rich in the game, now that we hacked the game and I have, what, 100 million coins, um, we can try to get a rare. I'm just going to keep breeding animals. I'm not going to even collect yield. I'm just going to start from the top, and I'm just going to keep breeding all the bases until I get an epic one. So where's the first base? We have... Elk, okay, here's literally the first base one. So click it, hit breed, and then we'll breed it with the snake. Hit breed, and we'll breed it. Snelk, okay. So wait, will this go to the bottom of the screen or will it go to the top? Let's check. God, the UI is so bad, bro. God damn, I need to fix that. You have to like click things literally like 10,000 times. Okay, so that's a, that's a rare. Okay, back up here. Back to the frog. Or, uh, yeah, we'll breed the frog and the zebra. Dude, when literally, like... Jack said no loops. It was a joke. Haha. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Fuse back, bro. Please don't do it, bro. <laughs> don't break their fire basic out. Hey, I'm not the one doing it, bro. I'm innocent, bro. All I do is hack the account. <laughs> but actually, don't actually don't break it, bro. I actually don't break it because that's not, that's not a good look. Uh, here, I'm, I'm going to send a message. Don't break their firebase. Please. All right. Go back over here. Yeah, no need to create random enemies with people we don't know. Like, I don't know. It, I doubt it would actually do anything. Um... I mean, it, here's the thing, like, I feel like Firebase, like, as a hosting provider, is smart enough to see, like, a million requests coming in and, like, block them. At least, also, it depends on, too, on how the, um, the servers are set up, because basically with JavaScript, there's, at least in React, there's, like, two different ways to accept requests, so you have one that's, like, an async type of async function. I, I, bro, I, can't, I don't remember the syntax, so I can't be like syntax specific, but basically there's like one that um, 
it has to requ- wait for a, a, the request to complete before it accepts any other requests. So all other requests that happen until that first request is done will just get ignored. But then like the new requests, but then there's another type of function basically where like it'll just stack them and it could still stack a million t- like requests and actually break their Firebase and potentially cost them like ten, like thousands of dollars, bro. So I don't know. Maybe don't do that. But oh yeah, we can close. Uh, we can close post, man. Since we've already we've already finished the the hack successfully. Go back to shoot. Where did I put the game? Okay, bring this back here. All right. Now let's now let's get some rare Pokemon, bro. Some. Some some rare Pokemon. Hold on. Back to here. Okay. All right, and move this over. All right, now I'm at, I feel like I've said it like three times, but now I'm actually going to just start breeding like fast. The issue though is, bro, every time I try, the UI is literally so dog water that like I can't do it fast. If only there was a way to like 69mega.com said new ai 84 percent will find a girlfriend thank you bro thank you yeah I, I, all right love the spam okay so let's see we got we can only burn that so click this hit no not burn breed and then we'll breed with the orca these animals will become will soon become parents was that there before or no? Oh, shoot. We already have the Zorka. My bad. I forgot we already had the one. Okay. So, frog. We already did bear frog, so we'll add the snake. Hit breed. Breed it together. Snog. Okay. Okay. Looks pretty normal. Do, do frogs have tails? Do frogs have tails? Or do they lose them when they're tadpoles or something? Do frogs have tails? They definitely have teeth. They have tails. In general, frogs produce no tail and strong web feet. Um. Okay. So yeah, they lose their tail basically, kind of like people do. They like lose their tail after after getting to like the tadpole stage. Okay. So we have a fox. We'll do we'll do fox and turtle next. Again, bro, the UI. Okay, so it looks like the best place to click for the UI is supposed to click their name. So Fox and the Turtle will hit breed. Let's see what we get. Yo, it's called Fertile. Nah, they're trolling, bro. <laughs> no way. It's called a Fertile. Bro, the art is so crazy looking. The eye, like, why did the eye, like, suddenly become big, bro? It looks like, it looks like the squirrel from over the hedge. Great movie, too. It literally looks like this thing, bro. That's crazy. I don't know. Anyways, back to back to breeding. All right, so giraffe. We'll do giraffe and bear next. Giraffe and bear. So hit. So like click the name. So giraffe and then bear. And then hit breed. Oh, yeah. I forgot we already, shoot, I, already, I forgot we already did this one. Okay. So we have bear. Did we do bear and orca? Did I do bear and orca? Let me see. Borka. Hell yeah. This is actually like a cool looking one, bro. It looks like a bulldog. Okay. So now let's do bear and turtle. Did I do that one? Breed. Torca. That looks just like, that literally looks just like a turtle. Bear and and then we'll do zebra and lion. Hit breed, hit lion, hit breed. No, I'm, I'm like 90% I already, I think, yeah, I already did this one. No, that's the Z bear. Shoot, did I not do this one yet? Let's see. Oh, where'd it go? The zebra, oh, <laughs> the zebra. That was a decent yield. All right, let's go, let's go back. We have turtbra, no, bear. And then we don't want to do bear again. We don't want to do Zorka. Snake? Do we do bear snake yet? I don't think so. Let's see. A bake? That's That actually looks pretty sick. All right. Um, 
What's left? I'm gonna keep going, bro. I'm gonna, I'm I'm literally the stream the stream ends when I get an epic. I'll end the stream. Wait, is there anything more rare than epic? Let's check first. We haven't gotten an epic yet. I haven't even gotten a super rare yet. Okay. The stream the stream ends when I get an epic. Remove that bot. I don't know how to. My bad, bro. I, I legit don't know how to. Felix Dev sent me a link to it um on how to how to edit um or like how to modify the stream, but I'm like I'm still pretty new to streaming, so like I'm not sure how to do it yet, how to like modify it. Uh so I'm not sure like what to do. I think I can delete the comments. But I have to sign into it's a whole thing, bro. I started using Brave Browser and I don't want to sign into any of my Google accounts on there because then I'll just be tracked by them. And I'll, it's like a whole like internet privacy thing I'm trying to do. Yeah, yeah. Uh NW. Shoot, I don't know what NW means. What does NW mean text? Yeah, yeah, no worries. Oh, okay, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, I'll, I will, no, I will, like, buy the next stream. Each stream is, like, gets a little better. Sometimes worse. Sometimes worse. Not gonna lie, sometimes worse. But each stream tends to get, like, a little bit better. So, by the next stream, hopefully, I'll have, like, the bots under control. It seems like that's something that people want to have fixed. So, all right, let's see. All right. Like I said, I'm gonna literally keep going, bro. I'm gonna keep going. The stream ends when I get an epic. I will end the stream. No context. Once I get an epic. Okay. We have... Zebra, and I'll breed it with, and do we already do Orca? Yeah, we did Orca. Do we do Lion? Do we do Zebra Lion? Yeah, we did. Zebra Bear? Yeah, we did. Um, What's left? Zebra Fox, we did not do. Shoot. Oh, it's already at the top. Okay. Breed? Zebrox. That's a, dude, that one looks so cool. Uncommon. All right. Dang. Okay. So turbo, fry, and bear. All right, so bear. Breed it with. I wonder if you have to like breed up. So two uncommons would produce like a rare. Let's see. So this is a common. Let's breed it with another common and see. We already did each of these. Did we do turtle yet? I don't think so. Let's try with turtle. Turbear. Okay, rare. We got a rare. We're getting closer. We just need to get the just need to get the epic. So. We will do zebra, and I'll breed it with a fox. Did we already do zebra fox? I think I did. Yeah, we already did zebra fox. Zebra orca? Yeah, zorka. Zebra panda? I don't think so. I don't think we did zebra panda yet. Let's try it. Panda bruh. Uncommon. Shoot. Okay. Let's do, let's go. Let's try snake. So we'll breed a snake. I don't think I did a snake and a giraffe yet. Let's do that one. The Snelk looks tough, bro. It looks like a, like one of those like dragons or whatever from like the Chinese New Year. <laughs> okay, Snaraf. Uh, okay, Stable Diffusion. Uh, Snaraf Uncommon. Okay. Let's see. So what's left to actually breed? So Giraffe Bear. I don't think we did a Giraffe Bear yet. Let's breed that. No, we actually did. Shoot, uh, Greer. Okay. So Orca. And then we'll breed the orca with, did I already do orca lion? I don't remember. We did orca panda? Did we do orca panda? That would be the orca? Yeah, okay. No, that would be bear orca. Okay, let's let's do orca panda. Pandorca? I think I might already have that one. Shoot, yeah, we already had that one. Okay. <clears throat> so the big orca, torca. Zorka, the names, the names, bro. They just get crazier and crazier. Okay, so bear. Oh, there's a penguin. Okay, let's breed the bear and the penguin. So penguin is it an epic? Shoot, it's a rare. Okay. All right, now I'm just gonna spam click eggs, bro. I'm gonna spam eggs, and I'm just gonna breed rares together and see if that works. And if I have to, we will just. Uh, I'll do another request. I'll just run that. Okay, yeah, yep. I'm just going to run the script again, the hack.js script, and we'll get some more free coins. So run this, hack.js. Wait, sorry, node hack.js. Hack.js, okay. 
It didn't do anything. Did it work? I think it worked. No, wait, what? My hack.js is not working anymore. What the heck? Node hack.js. It didn't do anything. Did I remove the function call? I did. We need to do hack and run the fu run the function. Okay. Shoot. Delete the L. That'll cause an error. Go back up here. Run node hack.js. 401. Expected OAuth2 token, login cookie, or other valid activation. Wait, what? Why am I gonna error now? Um I'm delete this. Still an error. No, the free coins. Your token resets? Oh, I didn't know that. Do you, um do the name does the name request uh reset or no? You gotta get a new bear? Okay. Good to know, good to know. Go here. Go back to network. Shoot. Oh, I got to slide this over. Go back to network. Click here. Go back to documents. Go to payload. And we'll just copy value, I think. Go to the JSON sorter. Command A. Delete this. Paste it back in. Oh, it pasted nice and nice and good for us. And we'll do format slash beautify. Grab this again. No, no, no. Just the bear. Oh, that's not how you get the bear token. I'm dumb. You have to, for the bear token, you have to do, the bear is in, is in the other place on the header. Yeah. The header. And then it should be the request header. Yeah. Authorization bear. Let's grab this. All of this mess. Copy that. Back to VS code. And then go here. Delete it. Paste in the new bear. Send the request. Are we rich again? Let's go. Okay. All right. We're back. Also, the egg the egg reset, which is good, too. Because it was definitely running us up like a whole bunch. Okay. Move this back over. This is hard work, bro. This is hard work. Hard work compared to school. Oh, gotta get these eggs. All right, we're not, look, we're mostly, we're, okay, we got a penguin, that's good. Bear, fox, orca, penguin again, lion. We need to try to get like a super rare starter. I'm just gonna keep going until we max it out. Close, are we close to maxing it out? Let's see. I'm checking up here, oh, I forgot you can't see like the coin total. But right here is my coin total, so I can see that I'm trying to get close to maxing it out. Okay. Another penguin. Okay, we maxed out. So let's see. Let's just let's breed the rarest, the rarest ones we have. So that would be the penguin and the elk. Let's let's breed two rares and see if that like leads to something that's more uncommon. So we'll breed it, and we'll breed it. Let's see if that works. The elegwin. What is that? So two rares. Gives a rare. I wonder if that's true for all of them. Let's so let's see. Let's try an uncommon. Let's breed the giraffe. Well, I guess I don't have to breed it again. I can just check. You can get a shark, which is a super rare, as a base animal. Oh, okay. Good to know. Good to know. Like I said, the stream ends once I get a once I get a um. Also, let's run this again. Okay. So reset this. Back to. It didn't work. Refresh. Unless it did work. Maybe it kept some of like the old coins. I'm not sure. But Jack said you can get a shark with a super rare. Huh. My main question is, does does the two types that you breed together matter? So a giraffe is a uncommon, which is a bear, which bears are common. And then a giraffe, which is uncommon. So either it takes in the type that is more rare than the other one and maybe it's that or huh not sure maybe it maybe maybe there's like oh i got a rhino okay we got a super rare we have a super rare that's good i didn't even see that okay so let's try to breed it 
I'm going to keep spamming. I'm going to keep spamming, getting more eggs until I get another super rare. And then we'll breed it, those two together. And hopefully we don't get like a common. Hopefully I get another rare. Um, or I mean epic. Okay. Close. We got a penguin. More bears, more commons. Spamming it. Okay, we ran out of eggs. Or ran out of coins. We'll just run the script again. Go back here. Refresh. Got a million coins. Jeez, this game would take so long if you were doing this without paying, bro. Like, you literally cannot get, like, the most rare ones. If this actually was an NFT game, bro, I would be so mad. Imagine, bro. Imagine spending a whole ETH, bro, for an egg. Actually, I don't think it was, I don't, th I think it was actually 0.1 ETH, which is, like, that's not nothing, bro. That's, like, $300. See the price of ETH. So, $1,200. So, 0.1 ETH would be, like, 10% of ETH. So, $120. Wait, Jax is, like, $350 for one? Was that like a fixed price? Did Logan have a fixed price? Too? But like also the the price of the price of ETH um a year ago when this project came out was like yeah, it was like around like 350. So mint price at the time. Yeah, it would have been yeah, it would have been like legit. Okay, this is 1 year ago. This is 5 years ago. It would have been like a little over a year. It would have been like 350. Who the fuck is going to pay 350 for an egg, bro? Like, you're actually, no, no, dude, you're, you're, nah. I don't know. That's crazy, bro. If you actually spent that money, like, legit trusting in Logan Paul, like, I don't really know what to tell you, man. Like, that's a lot of money to spend on a, on a picture of an animal. Jax just said about 3,000 people spent it. Oh, my gosh, bro. That's crazy. What? Wait, 350 times 3K? Look, okay. A, a three a three hundred fifty dollar investment, bro, is like that's actually not a big deal. If you lose three hundred fifty bucks betting on Logan Paul, like, okay, you lost three hundred fifty dollars. If you spammed, if you were like, if you're like me, but like using real money and you're just spam buying eggs, like, holy fuck, like, yeah, you would have spent a hundred k. Oh man, I don't know. It it just, it just seems like it seems like I don't want to be like blaming victims. Of, like, the fraud. Especially if you, like, have a family and stuff. Like, bro, that sucks. And, like, I don't know. I have no idea what that would be like. But at the same time, it's, like, it's... You're kind of, like, being, like, a little greedy by putting all your eggs in that... <laughs> literally putting all your eggs in that basket. Like, it's not... That's not, like, good, like, sound financial advice to do something like that. Like, even though, even though like, you know, an influencer is using an influence over you to, like, convince you to do something like that. Um... It just still seems like kind of weird, like to to trust to put that much faith in a picture of an egg is like beyond me, bro. To do something like that, I don't know. It's not even like you're buying like real estate or something where it's like a physical asset. Like I could understand like the financial crisis, like people getting caught up in that, but these are these are literally like animal pictures, bro. They're stock photos. They're stock photos. I don't know. All right, let's just keep spam. Spam buying so we get another super rare to breed together. Got elk. Dang, we're already out of coins. Maybe I should just up the... Let's up this value over here. Save a little more time. Let's add another zero. Hopefully that doesn't break it. No heck. Okay, refresh. Um. Yeah, okay, it worked. So we upped it by a whole magnitude, so... Back to spamming. And I'm just going to double check too that I didn't miss one. Down here. Dang, they were not joking when they said super rare, bro. That is super rare. Um, let's see. Oh, I have a better way. Super rare. Okay, so wait, I have multiple? I have oh I have a shark. See? Okay, that was good to check. So let's breed the shark and let's breed the rhino. Hopefully this will give us something more rare. Shino. It's another super rare. Dang. So close. Okay. Well, I'm going to see. Let's see how many more super rares we have. We have two more. Uh, Yeah, I have two rhinos. So I'm going to breed one of the rhinos. I'm going to breed with the penguin. My guess is that it'll be another super rare. And that it takes on like the rarity of the more rare one, if that makes sense. So penguino. That's a cool looking one. 
let's see. I was right, bro. It is a super rare. So it looks like the way it works is that if I get an epic common, or like not a common, but an epic base one, and I breed it with another one, it'll be a super rare. Let's see. Jack Cutie said, Pixelmon Crypto, it was a guy that was 21 years old that created a 3D pixel collection. That sold for $75 million. Dude, yo, yo re re actually respect to that dude, bro. Like, that's that's fire. That's cool. But, dang. That's still, like, you guys are really chasing a return on your dollars, like, that hard. So, Pixel. I'm going to look it up really quick. Pixel Mon Crypto. Is a unique and refreshing virtual metaverse that anyone can trade to cooperate? I wonder if it was also made on ETH. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh my gosh. Sold for 75 mil. That's crazy. I wonder when it sold. It was on ETH. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. If you if anyone's also seen the Fireship video, um Fireship literally explains in that video like pretty straightforward how you could build something like this. But I don't I don't I wouldn't I wouldn't want to build a a crypto project unless I could really deliver value. See, I already sound like Logan Paul, bro. I, I don't know. I just, it seems weird, like, to put just images on an NFT. Like, maybe if you put a song on an NFT, it would make a little bit more sense or something. Like, something like that. Like, a song or, I don't know. But, hopefully Easy Right, hopefully Easy Right can get, like, a fraction of not not even like the money bro because i'm not really building it for money i'm mostly building it so i don't have to ever write emails again but hopefully you can get like a fraction of like the user base that would be really cool to get more people using it so it's a whole i assume that pixelmon is a whole like nft world similar to like the metaverse where you can build stuff in it that would be my guess but that's crazy though this dude really just damn at 21 bro W guy. All right. Let's see if we got any more. Oh, I, I guess I should have uh, I should have searched for Epic here, too. The same way. Let's see if I have any Epics. No, still no Epics. Okay. So let's breed. Did I already start the breeding? Let me check at the top. No. Okay. So super rare. Okay. So we'll grab the Rhino. Wait. No. Didn't I already establish that it won't be a, an Epic? An Epic or no? Whatever, I'm going to do it anyways because, yeah. I'll, I'll just check one more time. So, super rare. We'll find the Shino. Let's go back up. We'll grab this one. Hit breed. We'll breed it with the next most rare item, which would be... I could do a penguin. I could do, I'll could do. i do an elk. Okay, back to the top. Hit breed. Elk Eno. Bruh, it's still super rare. Okay. I have to unlock... Mindy said... Oh, uh, what's the website to play this? I can't find it. Um, it's called it's called realzoo.itsy.com. And also we uh on this stream, <laughs> shout out to uh JQD and uh, uh and Felix Bennett. We we hacked it too to get unlimited coins. So if you want to get the unlimited coin hack, I guess I could post that in my Discord. I could put the files in it. You do have to like go get your own tokens and stuff. It's a little complicated. But if you have like, any experience coding, it's not like too bad. Um but hold on. I just have to put put the link in. No, actually, hold on. I can't I can't put the link in. Here's the link up here. Minzy said LMFAO. Yeah. The link is up there. It's real zoo dot the the reason I can't paste it in the chat is a whole thing right now. Felix Ben said so not gonna lie. I haven't I haven't done the loop hack. Oh good bro, I'm glad. Ian Rouse said, let's go. That, I'm glad you have not done the loop hack, bro. We did not want to actually break this whole game live on stream. That would have been an L. It would have been funny. It would have been a good scream highlight. But, no, nah, we don't want to do that. Mizzy said, cheers, bub. Yeah, cheers, bro. This man said, I may have made the entire script optimized for multiple accounts. No. <laughs> no, bro. We don't want to break this. We don't want to break their whole thing. Anyways. Did I breed these already or no? Uh, no. Okay, maybe I did. Okay, I did. All right, back to spam clicking. Like I said, the stream ends when I get an epic. So hopefully hopefully soon. I've been live for like a minute now. So the, the stream ends when I get an epic. 
Uh, Jack said I may have shared your YT in the Discord. Ha, ha. Oh, okay, that's cool, bro. It doesn't matter. Like I said, this this this, this stream is ending soon, anyways. Uh, Jack said has seven viewers. Yo, that's my max. <laughs> Ian Rouse said, "Oops, Jack." See now, now we really don't want them to break to break it because they know they know the YouTube channel now, so uh, it'll be like right back to me. But it, like I wasn't gonna do it anyway, so it's all good. Oh, we ran out of coins. All right, run this run the script. Jack said, "No, no, it's all good." Okay, sweet, bro. Nah, cause I'm really not on that. Oh yeah, let's just check for rare. No, no, not rare. Super rare. So no, we don't have. So we have a rhino to breed, and he said, "Check my code. I my code. I sent it in Discord." The script though, <laughs> bro. We gotta get. I need to get free coins, bro. <laughs> I can't. I can't afford this game. It's, I don't. Have, I don't. I don't have enough ETH. Still no epics. Dang. All right, we're spamming this. Feels man, I'm gonna check. Uh, feels man said check the Discord. I'm gonna check it in a second. I'm not running it though. Okay. All right. Let me check it. Let me check it really quick. So, what we have is. So start hacking. Did I miss something? Wait, you didn't put in. You didn't put the start hacking function in. Uh, Ed Nunes said, "What the egg though?" Yeah, literally, bro. All right. I don't see the um. Unless it's this, yeah, I don't see the, I don't see the star hacking function, so I'm not sure like what you meant. Okay, back to back to spamming. Then I said, Felix Ben said I upgraded it since then. Okay, hopefully you find it soon, brother. Like I said, the the stream ends when I get an epic. We're going for it. It's crazy how many how many eggs I've bought, bro, and I I only have like a couple super rares still. Minzy said, thank God you're not streaming on Twitch, LOL. I am streaming on Twitch, bro. I'm multi-streaming. Also, why would it why would it matter if uh someone is also streaming like or streaming on Twitch? Oh, I have more super rays? Okay. What's it? We have a Shino Rhino. Let's see, go up. So let's grab the rhino. We'll hit breed. Sad that rhinos are super rare, given that they're actually like an endangered species. Like that's lucky sad. Um, oh, no, I have nothing. I can't breed it with anything else. Okay. That's okay. Go back up to the top. Um, close this. Is there a way to close it? Can I close it? Okay. All right, back to spamming eggs. So, I think my, like, wait. Ian Rouse said Zorka is my epic? That doesn't make sense, bro. Zorka is common. I can somehow get a common that is also an epic, like, can it change rarity or no? Felix Ben said check again. Okay, but I'll check in a second, bro. Mindy said, oh, sometimes Twitch bans you for hacks, etc. Oh, seriously? What's the best hybrid you got? Um, the best hybrid that I have is the uh it's the rhino one. It's the yeah, the I would say Peng Penguino is cooler. No no Shino. Yeah, Shino's hard. I would say Shino. Uh, no, it's one rare. Jack said no, it's one rarity. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. All right, let's check. Let's check the code quick. Back to Ian Rell said no, it's epic to me. Cap, bro. Cap, gotta be cap. All right. So let's see. So now it says so start hacking. Wild true. I plus plus. Console hack hack attempt I hack hack two. Jeez. All right, yeah, bro, don't run this, bro. Don't like just just don't run this, bro. <laughs> don't run this, because this wild true is not even gonna like it, it. It's just never gonna stop. Like, I mean, obviously, I'm pretty sure everyone in here can code, but yeah, that'll literally just keep spamming requests to Firebase. And I don't know if Firebase makes you pay per request, but if it does, bro, like, yeah, that's gonna that's gonna cost him like a whole bunch of money. Probably all the money that he made. From buy from people buying uh, uh tokens, so I don't know. All right, let's check if I got an epic. Let's see, epic. Dang, still no epic. Okay, back to spamming. Back to spamming. Ah, oh, this is hard work, bro. All right, let's see. We got 
Epic, more. Okay, we maxed out. Let's run the script. If I run it twice, though, will it just reset? Or will it double the amount of coins? Will it show 2 million or 1 million? Nah, or just uh, 100 million. Okay, back to spamming. Orca, bear, elk, panda, turtle, bear, frog, turtle, snake, bear, zebra, orca, frog, orca. Goddamn, nothing? Jeez. Are, okay, do epics actually exist, bro, or is this dude trolling, bro? Like, imagine I was actually getting trolled right now, and there's, like, no epics. Panda, bear. I'm going to keep going until... I'm not even going to check the rarity until I get to... um Until I spent literally all the coins. Let's see. Are we getting there? Oh, I think I saw one. Wait. Epic? I spelled it wrong. Epic? Oh. Also, I just realized uh, you can't see this, but the way I'm... Since I have so many animals now, the way I'm searching for it is I just do command F and then I just search for it by like, um, like that, just like on the page. So super rare. And then I just like go through the page like that. If that makes sense. Cause I literally have so many animals at this point that there's no way to like just scroll through it. Okay. Back to the top. Back to spamming. Turtle, lion, zebra, bear, geez, frog, zebra, snake. Okay, we maxed out on coins. Back to here. Back to the script. Run it again. No to heck. Close that. Back to spamming. Back to spamming. Fox. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm I even like, I feel like I'm not even like close. I wonder if, like, is it set? Like, it's just like completely random. Like, if it's one in like 10k or something, the chance I would, I could be here for like another hour. Literally spamming this, but yeah. I don't know, like I said, the, the stream... I'm just going to cut the stream once I get an epic. Oh, was that one? Hold on. Command F. Epic. Dang, still no epic. The unfortunate thing about this game, too, I think, is that I'm pretty sure I need to get an epic common to breed it. Because I want, like, I want to get an epic and then I want to, like, breed it into something. But if I can't, like, breed it, if I can't, like, breed two rares together to get an epic, that means that there's basically no chance to get it unless you get an epic egg. Okay, we maxed out. Feels I said, I think you need to breed for epic, for the epic common. Uh, do you? I could check. That. I mean, I guess I could just look in here. All right, let's see. So snake, super rare, super rare. So snug. So, so yeah. So the parent would be a pug plus a snake. So it looks like, in order to get an epic. At least one of the ones that you, like, your parents needs to be an, an epic. So, the duck, which I assume is an epic. Also, this is a weird, is there no, wait, is pug epic or is, no, yeah, because rhino's super. Okay, so duck is epic. Yeah, okay. That means that, yeah, one of the parents needs to be an epic and it does take on the higher rarity. So, for example, bear plus duck is an epic. So, I have to, like, keep going and spamming until I get an epic from one of these. I guess I could have figured that out by just like clicking or just by reading that the whole time, but whatever. Jeez, bro, imagine, bro, imagine you actually spent like the money to to get these coins. That would be crazy. We're getting there. Also, I wonder I wonder uh, if these fire ship requests are showing up. Like if you can see this much activity of like me just literally spamming it. And how long is how long until it gets shut down? <laughs> Alright, let's see. Felix said, I think you need to breed for Epic. Yeah. All right. I'm going to keep going until I max out on coins. Maybe I should move my... I'll move this over a little bit. Not that. Move this up. No. Not that. Not that. Okay. This. I'm going to move me over a little bit. Hopefully that doesn't look too bad. So now you can see the coins. Can you see the coins? Oh, no. Okay, I maxed out. Run the hack. Get to the top. Back to spamming. Is it not working? Okay. Back to spamming. Jeez. Jax uh, said plug plus duck equals mythical. Is that true? Let's see. Uh, Where'd it go? Where's so pug, duck? No, it's not. Isn't it? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Where's duck? So he's pug, I think. Plus, because Ben said, I think there is a timeout. So even if, if I ran the script, I just stop me. Oh, that would actually make sense if there was a timeout. So like those together, 
So equals mythical. Hold on. So two epics can get you a mythical. So puck. So there's only two mythicals. And they're the same. They're just the puck. So there's all. So puck is the only one. Interesting. I think that puck is. Is this the puck then? Like his Twitter handle, or is that that? No, that's got to be a bear. A bear plus a duck. Huh. So we have. Snug. Are there okay? Are there any other? Are there any epics that don't have. The. Bear plus bear and duck. Oh yeah. Wait, is it so? Is it the bear and duck? No, that would be. What starts with P? Pug. Okay. So let's see. We have. The porka. That'd be pug still. Huh. Shug. What the heck is a shug? Oh, the shark. Okay. And that's to be a legendary. Yeah. So okay, literally nothing I can do unless I unlock one of the epics, which is duck or pug. So there's only two of ones that I can get. So, all right, back to spamming. Back to spamming. Dang. All right. Whew. Sigma grind set right here. Sigma grind set. I worked hard for these coins, man. Uh, Felix Bennett said, have you got the mug yet? What the heck is a mug? I assume you, you mean pug? Nah, no pug. I'll just check for epic. Epic? No epic. All right, back to spamming. Uh, no mug. Yeah, no mug. Back to spamming. Lions, pandas, turtles, elks, fox. Okay. All right. We'll send the coin, the, the coin hack again. Refresh. Uh, 100 million coins again. All right. Penguin. Uh, Felix Bennett said the developer just announced a mug. Oh, really? Wait, on his Twitter or... What the heck is that? Wait, you, wouldn't you have to, like, breed a mug or no? Also, I'm assuming he announced it on his Twitter. Also, since we started this stream a few hours ago, he's gone up 30 Twitter followers. That's huge. Like, on Twitter, that's good. So, he increased the amount. Wait, that no, that's yesterday. I assume he announced it in the Discord then. Also, let me, let me hang up this call. Okay. So, back to this Discord server. So, Yippee announced mug. Uh, dang, this development is happening fast. Like, it's literally happening. Like, in the hours that I've been playing the game, like, new features have come out, apparently. So, Jack's Cutie said, there is a social link on their website now, LOL. Um, what's their website? And also, did he paste the website in the description here? Bro, this, like, watch, watch me refresh this, and I bet he's, I bet he's already getting, like, maybe 200 subscribers. Like, this video actually has gone, like, pretty viral. Um, geez, that surprised me. Yeah, he gained. He gained 400 subscribers just in the time that I've been screaming. Uh, just that in the time that I've been streaming this, and I think it went up like 60k views. It's just crazy, bro. Like Coffeezilla commented, um, Ludwig commented, like a whole bunch of big creators commented. Like that's actually huge. Who the heck is Jack? Um, I don't know. Back to this. Back to this Sigma grind though. All right, spamming eggs. Spamming eggs. Oh, uh, Felix Man said scroll down to general and chat. He announced it. Okay. Let's check general. Uh, let's see. Is this it? No, that's not it. Malik is a mug. Okay. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, wait, I actually remember that. I remember what you're talking about, what mug is for the UK. All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, good one, guys. Good one. You got me. Oh, the dev announced it. All right. <laughs> G GG's, bro. GG's. <laughs> That's funny. All right, back to back to spamming. Back to spamming. We gotta we gotta unlock this. Penguin, zebra, bear. Uh, that, uh that's what you get when you <laughs> Malik plus pug equals mug. <laughs> that was funny. Uh, let's see. Felix Bennett said, got you. Yeah, you got me. GG's. <laughs> All right. I'm going to check for Epic once I get, once I max out the coins. And you can see the, you can see the coins like in the corner of the screen, kind of. Um, hopefully you can see that. Wait, I don't even know where to, I can't point. I got to do my mouse. Right here is the coin total. And just in case you were wondering. So, 
Zebra. Okay, max out on coins. Let's run the hack again. Shoot, I didn't mean to put the slash. Clear? Okay. Run the hack. Oh, uh, wait. Delete, delete, delete. Run the hack. Refresh the page. And then we'll do Command F and we'll check for epics. Epic? Oh, I have an epic. I got the duck. All right, we got the duck. We got the duck. Okay. So we'll hit breed. Also, the duck art is the duck art is good. The duck art is good for sure. Okay. And then we need to breed it with another super rare, which I think if I have a shark, I'll do it with a shark. Shark? No, we don't have a shark. Okay. Uh, Felix Ben said you finna lose that duck. Nah, I'm not losing any duck, am I? Uh, dude, I, bro, if I do this and it's not a super, I'm not going to check. I'm not checking the spreadsheet. Okay, let's do, what's another, let's just check super rare. Super rare. So duck plus rhino, no, I don't think so. Duck plus, duck plus what? Duck plus what? Panda? No, nah, that's dumb. Not panda, okay. So we can do, is rhino all I have? No way duck plus rhino is a super rare. Also, I want to do something better than uh, rhino. Let's see. I could do duck plus super rare, which is zebra. Uh, shark. No, it's snake. Okay, it looks like any of these actually will work. Duck, duck. Duck plus P-U-G. I don't know. I'm not sure what that means. Duck plus. Looks like I can, I can literally pick pretty much any animal. So I'll just do whatever I think the coolest one is then. I'll do duck plus... Snake, no. Duck plus fox, no. Nah. It's got to be something that's like not too good. Duck plus elk. Let's do duck plus elk. Bro, if this is not a super rare, like, I, I'm we're literally back to spamming. I think I was spamming for like 10 minutes. All right, hit breed. Delk? Is it an epic? Oh, uh, let's see. Go down to the bottom. Epic. Let's go. That's the stream. Thank you for watching. Um, please subscribe. Uh, I will either be live again Monday um, or tomorrow. I don't know yet. Uh, Felix Ben said, I bet you got scammed. How did I, how did I get scammed? I had free, I had free coins. <laughs> uh, anyways, thank you for watching. Um, please subscribe. I will release a video uh, hopefully tomorrow. So, yeah. All right. Peace out, guys. You